some changes. Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Samuel. Welcome to 11th of February. Today is a stream where we play Final Fantasy 14, and also you get glasses, Sam, because my contacts are eating away at me like crazy. It is cold in my house, and I have no idea what's going on. Whatever. It's cold outside, and it's cold inside as well. I don't want to turn on the heater because otherwise I can smell the burning air smell whenever the heater's on. I don't know what it's about. Also, my glasses are dirty as hell, but whatever. I think I'll be fine. Anyway, get a dirty, get a dirty glass of stamp for tonight. Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Today we're gonna to be playing some Final Fantasy XIV and uh, just gonna be messing around there. Maybe doing some class quest stuff that I haven't done yet. Maybe leveling a class. Maybe doing some something interesting. Maybe running into interesting people as well. Who knows? We'll be doing some fun stuff here. <laughs> welcome guys. Welcome to the stream. Hello Ivan, hello Fia, hello Andre, hello something Bert, hello Leonardo, hello Wericolite, and I think no Taurus is still not here, I guess he's still lurking around. <laughs> and uh, some the fact that you got to drive around a BMW, that's pretty impressive, dude. Um, regarding like my uh, driving school, which was just the hell of my high school, uh, my state ends up investing a lot of money into education, even though it's not prominent most of the times because a lot of tech in you know, my high school was pretty crap, and even though a lot of taxes are invested into that, it's just still, it, you don't see it. Um, but when we were doing our driving tests and driving practices at my high school, we actually drove around really nice looking Mustangs. And Mustang is actually a kind of a nice car to drive around uh, in the States. It's not like a BMW, like, it's not like that kind of like extra extravagant but it's pretty something like it was a nice big long mustang and everything and it was really nice to drive and they had some other crap cars that other students get to drive around I actually unfortunately I got to drive around the crap car <laughs> got to share that with my brother and another person while we doing the drum practices and kind of getting hours squared uh, squared off during summer because apparently that's what we had to do in order to get our uh, we had to give out uh, driving approval before we could go apply for driving license yeah it wasn't really fun <laughs> But anyway, uh, yeah, we ended up uh, having a lot of Mustangs at my high school. They just kind of sat in the back to be driven by students and hopefully not crashed. <laughs> there we go, now about is working properly, sounds good, awesome. Alright, see so what's going on here. Speaking of downloading Final Fantasy XI, uh, it has a new patch out. Well then, I'm going to have to download it. I had a problem with, uh, what is it called, like, something play for it? I don't know. It's it's like a legacy feature that I had to make sure that it works for Windows 10, reinstalled and everything. Finally got it working because we just crashed my desktop for no reason. I think I got it working now. Probably gonna try recording a little bit of Final Fantasy XI tomorrow and uh, see what it's like, but I'm very much looking forward to it. And patching is not a big deal for me, to be honest. So I can't literally gift you a game, so here's a dumb question that I have tried to Google. How do I send you the game code? Uh, Ivan, you can send me the game code by purchasing the game. Uh, let's say if you go purchase on Steam, you and we want to purchase something as a gift, right? If you go do that and purchase as a gift, for Steam, like a Steam code gift, you could technically just make it so that it sends you an email with a code for the game, right? It'll send you an email. And then 
if you want to send that code to me, I could try applying to Steam and that could work out because, I don't know, I guess maybe just the country, like, just, I don't know, something, maybe that's like a regional thing, who knows, like, I mean, Andre couldn't give me a game either, so, uh, maybe it's that, I don't know, but yeah, <laughs> I guess that's probably the only way to work out for it, I, I would think, Let's see what's going on here in chat. So East of Alamigo, you guys are talking about the soaps and stuff. I've not really done anything for Beastman, to be honest, uh, person myself. <laughs> I've not, I've done nothing whatsoever. I kind of skipped out the Beast, Beastman and went right to Heaven's Ward and uh, kind of messed around anyway. <laughs> Thamp, you have a small uh, level tune. I'll come level up with you. Ah, uh, yeah, I have plenty of classes that are very low level. Yeah, plenty of them, and we could probably definitely level them in like dungeons and guild heads and stuff like that. I'd be totally down for that. Let me make sure to launch the game here. There we go. Uh, if you do want to level a uh, certain class together, I have a Dark Knight, which is at level 50. So if you get Heaven's Ward, uh, when when you get Heaven's Ward, if you want, if you are getting Heaven's Ward, we could maybe see if you can like put together like a Healer Tank DPS kind of party and just kind of spam lots of dungeons every now and then and see if you can power level or something like that. That'd be pretty cool because I still got my Dark Knight that needs to be uh, leveled up to level 60. I got some gear for them, but not a lot. I got the weapons, the uh, the helmet, most of the pieces except like maybe earrings and stuff. That's the only thing I need to get. I need to run some, uh, some dungeon runs to get the law. Oh wait, that's the password, not the one-time password. One bad. I go and do this. Here we go. Now I enter the one-time password. There we go. All right, let's get right into the game, guys. Let's get right into the game. Hey, kids, and welcome to the stream, buddy. Welcome, welcome. Playing some fan, uh, Final Fantasy XIV tonight. How you doing today? Let's see what's going on here, chat. I have DLC and I'm level 50. Nice. Oh, you got you got the Heaven's Ward. Oh yeah, you do have the Heaven's Ward. Yeah. Uh, then we could just easily level uh, Dark Knight and maybe see if we can get another healer, another DPS, and just like power level level 50 to level 60 or something. <laughs> I don't know. Possibly. Half my items for my animal open come from the Beast Man Daily Quest. Gotcha. Well. As far, like me personally, I'm probably not going to be coming around to doing any of the animal weapons, sadly. Maybe I will. Maybe at certain point I'll be like, you know what, I probably could run them easily, no problem. But uh, for a while I'm probably not going to just dabble into it simply because I don't know much about it. I'll probably look up a guide on it maybe and slowly but surely start getting, you know, little by little into it and uh, dip my feet into it. But for now I'm just going to be like, eh, just going to be do my thing. Apparently the... The in patch 3.2, they're gonna be adding another tier raid or something with more gear. I'm looking forward to that. I'm gonna see if I can get myself uh, my hands on that piece of loot as fast as possible. It probably won't be in a while, so I guess I'll just have to wait for a little bit. Let's turn out the background music a little bit more so we can just have background music playing like this. Uh, and while I'm looking to be like a, up to 59, that'll be fine. Let's go and log on to my main character. Gonna be uh, a bit quiet, feeling sick right now, and wasn't able to sleep last night. I'm sorry, Kitsune. I'm real sorry about that, bud. Hope you're feeling uh, better, and uh, yeah, hopefully we can uh, cheer you up through the stream. <laughs> hey, Lindsay, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. We're playing some Final Fantasy 14 tonight. How are you doing today? But I have a lot of story to do first. Oh, yeah, no, if you want to go through a story, go for it. Have fun with that. But you still gotta do have the story before you can access Hammond's World Surf. Yeah, you gotta do a decent amount of story, which I know they're gonna try to implement to that. Uh, at least now, okay, you should have said that. They understand that it's a little bit over cumbersome for players to get through, so they wanna try to limit that, or whenever, like, let's say the next expansion comes out, they wanna make sure that the, the majority of the meat, like for the after patches kind of thing, kind of gets cut out for the new players so they don't have to go through all that story then kind of get a digest of it, quick digest, and then move on to the expansion. So they want to implement a system for that. But nevertheless, you can get a ton, ton, I mean like literally a ton of new gear with, uh, not, not new gear, but like at least like gill, lots of gill with that. Not experience bonus much, but hey, if you want to run any of the Prima stuff for the story quest, just let me know, and I will gladly run Prima stuff with you. I'm currently on my Conjurer. Should probably see if I can change to a new class here. Let's see. Let me go ahead and do this here so that the game has a little bit more CPU power to it and runs a little, a little bit, a little bit better, a little bit, you know, a little more ergonomic, sort of ergon ergonomic. I have no idea. <laughs> Right, first thing I kind of want to do though is repair, otherwise it's going to bug the heck out of me. Let's go ahead and do that. I think, yeah, there we go, Merchant Mender. Let's go ahead and repair here. And let's see, repair gear. Let me check on OBS, make sure the green screen is good. No tears in the nether. 
Okay, yeah, we're good. Mark Chan is a little bit cut out, but I think it'll be alright. Yeah, we'll just move Mark Chan a little bit more like this. Yeah, we're good. We're good, guys. <laughs> we're good. There we go. Alright, uh, repair all. There we go. Let's see. What can I level? Oh, hello there. Hey, Andre, I see you in the game. There we go. Alright, uh, let's see. Class, class, class. What kind of class do I have currently? I got a couple of classes here. Let me actually check the class panel and see which class I can level at the moment or kind of do stuff with. I mean, the only one I have at level 50 is Dark Knight. I guess I could do, like... I'm not good at tanking. I'm not still used to the tanking, but I guess I could probably run as Archer. Uh, if you want to do any of the problems that you need to do for the story. Hey, German, welcome to stream, buddy. Welcome, welcome. How you doing tonight? Sorry about that. <laughs> hey, fam. Could you make a three-man team with me? You and Surfin and level some low-level classes. Yeah, that'd be to I'd be totally down for that. I'd be completely down for that. Like, this is this is the two hours or three hours or whatever for us to play Final Fantasy XIV. I'm totally down for that. As long as it doesn't lag me up. <laughs> that would be wonderful. Welcome back, something. Uh, let's see. You guys should have came to my server. I am sadly... Well, not sadly. I'm, I'm proudly on... Uh, Exodus, and I'm pretty happy about it. There we go. I see some for bird. I see you. Let's see what else is going to hit in chat. Let's see what time if you want to start exploring the beast tribes. I'm about to go show them to something. Ah, uh, yeah, I guess I could probably do that. Well, why not? I'd be totally down for that. Invite me and something for party. Yeah, I could do that. Let me go ahead and do that here. Invite to party. See, I'm not much of a Kind of a party leader kind of person, but I guess I can invite people to party. Let me just miss Chase over here. I can probably keep him around for a bit. And now we got a full live party. <laughs> now we got a full on live party. Let's go ahead and switch over to Bard. I'm gonna meet up with you guys. So, where should I be going at the moment? Where should we go? Is there something about the Sylphs? I know we can go to the Sylph lands uh, to go to the Sylph stronghold, but I don't know much about like where the promise will be located at. So, yeah, I wouldn't really know much. Uh, where, uh, let's see, how do I take let me go ahead and type this in chat. There we go. What, uh, let's see. What beastman are we going for? Also, I need to stop by and withdraw my hat so I can glamour my bar hat onto this class, because I kind of like my hat. Uh, I'm going fine, and Dandy, how about yourself? Oh, you're doing fine, Dandy, how about yourself? I'm doing pretty good. It's a little cold in my house, and my contacts have been eating the hell out of my eyes. I don't know why, which is why I'm wearing glasses, but I'm doing pretty good. You know, uh, tomorrow's party. I'm going to get to chill back and uh, relax a little bit. Totally down for that, and play some cry fear. Looking forward to that, for sure. I'm doing Amaja, so it's the easiest one for me to show you first. Meet me at Little Alamigo. A little Alamigo, let's see, where would Little Alamigo be at? Little Amigo, Little Amigo, it's, I think, Thanalan? Little Amigo, Little Amigo. Where is Little Alamigo? I, complete, <laughs> I completely don't remember anymore. <laughs> I have no idea anymore. Little Alamigo. Where is that at again? Nope, oh, my bad. There we go. I have no idea where Little Amigo is at. I'm trying to remember it. It's not a Mordona. I know that because that's Mordona. It's the only place. It, Mordona just has Mordona in there. Southern Thanlan. Oh, yeah, that. Oh, wait, is it? Little Amigo. Little, oh, okay, gotcha. Little Amigo. That's what it is. There we go. One party members were unable to teleport. Well, it's fine. I'll get to see everybody there in a bit. <clears throat> XP party, Final Fantasy XI style. <laughs> that would be. Pretty fun. I'll be totally down for that. Actually, me and Andre end up playing uh, a little bit a couple of days ago where we just ran a... I believe he ran a... No, he wasn't running... No, he was running... Were you running a Marauder? Or, yeah, were you running a Marauder or Gladiator, Andre? I have don't remember. I think you were running a Gladiator and you had a Chocobo out and I was running my Conjurer and I had my Chocobo out and we ended up doing a bunch of Fates and actually level up to level 15. That was actually pretty cool. Hey, there you are, and your epic mount. I got my semi-epic mount as a two-seater, which is pretty amazing. That people can ride with me if they want to. But yeah, no, no big deal. You know, just a big giant chicken, just a giant ass chocobo. You were marauder, yeah, that's that's what you were. I knew you were some sort of a tank. I just didn't, didn't remember which one you were exactly. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and wait up here and see where we can go from here. Hey, Farzix, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. You're from Brazil, nice dude. Well, welcome to the stream. Trap? All right, cool, Barclay. Wait, where are you? We are all over here, actually. There we are. We're all just kind of gathering together here. <laughs> Slowly waiting for Andre over here. And after that, we'll know exactly where to go. 
You want a man on my chocobo? I got a two-seater. <laughs> Never mind, you can just ride your you can just ride your horse. <laughs> Sounds good. Count me. Alright, cool. I'm going for that. Let's see. I believe Amaja might be they're either in this area or they're up here next door. No, they're probably the Ring of Ash. That's probably where it was. I completely forgot about that. <laughs> see guys, I never really did any of the Beastman tribes or anything. I kinda was very late to that. I kind of joined the game like a month or a couple months before the expansion was out. So by the time the expansion was out, I didn't really get to explore too much of the vanilla game. So yeah, I kinda missed out on a lot of things. Like Beastman and all that. Sorry, the stream lag. Yeah, it's fine. Don't worry about it. It's not a big deal. There's gonna be some stream delay every now and then. It's not too bad. I think we go over here. There we go. Should be a quest for you around here. I think I already did this before. I discovered these guys. I just don't remember if I can do anything with them. I remember I discovered them before. I just don't know how I can track. I guess I just gotta talk to them and see if maybe they can give me some quests. To be honest, I have no idea what. But I can just kind of chill with them for a bit and just kind of uh, hang out with them. <laughs> Maybe there's like a entombment process I have to go for these guys, I just don't remember it at the moment. Be right back then, I'm going to stream. Sounds good, German? Well, good luck with your stream, and we'll see you in a bit. To start on my job? Nope, I guess you didn't have a quest here yet. Hmm. Maybe it's something you get throughout, like, later. I guess I need to do more story, etc. to get it. Maybe? Possibly? I don't really know the, how difficult the entombment process is. For the Amaja. I don't know if I have a quest with them. Maybe there's something else I need to grab in order to start it up with them. Because at the moment, I don't think I have it either. I discovered them before. I remember discovering them. Uh, Steal Amaja. Oh, wait, no, I did talk to them before, didn't I? Uh, let's see. Trade? More talk. What did it say? We should trade. Show you loyalty to the Brotherhood, and through deeds of courage and glory, you will earn the right to Brasma wares. Hmm. Maybe I gotta talk to the Mender. Now, if you want. He won't be able to talk to me either because I haven't earned stuff with him. So I guess I can't do anything really with these guys either. Maybe I could talk to Hamajga. Maybe he might have something. Hamajga, what's up? Nope, he has nothing for me. Never mind then. <laughs> Maybe it's a quest I already have here. I just never really did anything with. Global Initiative, that's not it. Maniac Manor, it could be possibly that. Maybe. Although I'm very doubtful of that. I don't know, I'll have to look up some kind of guides online to make sure I know how to properly tune with these guys, but I guess we could do it later. I mean, they're Wikipedia on that all the time, so if I really want to get into them. As far as I understand, you need the promise in order to get into crafting, and in order to do level meets with crafting, uh, with them to like advance level meets and just make crafting, and leveling crafting in general a lot better, you can just kind of go with them. And it was a system implemented, as far as I understand, for crafters, and that's about it. Can't do it without you. Uh, I don't know really. Check level 45, 47. There should be one to make it available. Uh, level 47. A kobold initiative uh, will carry one prayer to strike against the kobolds and will result in pirates of Lucent to cause. Convey your message to the commander boating at Camp Overlook. I don't have that. That's not it. For me, uh, Peace of Thanlan. Maybe it's Peace of Thanlan. Wait for Ambush to reveal themselves. Oh, it is Peace of Thanlan. That's what it was. That's what I gotta do. Okay, cool. Let me see if I can get over to it. Hmm, Peaceful Thanalan, maybe th maybe that's what it is. Maybe I just got a... Oh, there is, there's a carefree merchant here. Hello, how's it going? Maybe I have to do it solo? I'll probably have to do the solo. That's probably what it is. Let's see, no idea then. Forgotten Springs, that's the one. Let's see, Forgotten Springs, let me see. Peace I got Peaceful Thanalan, that's about it. It's level... Teleport to Forgotten Springs. Alright, apparently we're going to Forgotten Springs then. I'm totally down for that. <laughs> Let's go and do it. Let's discover some things here. Okay. So what am I doing here? And there's a person dead. If I could only help him. I can't. I can't help him whatsoever. What's it to you? Is it that quest maybe? Maybe it's a what's it to you quest. Let me check it out. Maybe this. Maybe this will allow us to talk to the primals. Uh, No. It's something else here. That's for sure. Maybe it's... Hmm. Back in the Saddle, uh, Zombies are People too. I kind of want to go check out Back in the Saddle and see what that's like. I will see if I can check out that southern area over there. Take a chance to allow local classes. Oh, yeah, we, I mean, we could still do that. Let me just, uh... Let me just check a quest out real quick. I'm gonna check out the quest real quick. Not really participate in this fate. 
Gonna go ahead and skip over that. I want to see if I can run all the way to the southern area over here and see what the back in the saddle quest is. Maybe it's the one for uh, for the Amaja. Who knows? We're gonna go ahead and check it out. There are a lot of quests in Final Fantasy XIV that I've yet to even do because I just simply don't know what they are about. I just kind of have them there and I never really got to partake in them. But eventually I will. Eventually I'll come around and actually do every single quest of Final Fantasy XIV. It's just didn't really have the time to do them at the moment. I was just kind of rushing to, you know, Heaven's Ward, and now most of the stuff... Did I drop another cap? God damn it, did I? Where'd it go? <laughs> I dropped a freaking bottle cap. God damn it, that's not good. That's not good. If I accidentally spill my water over my computer sub, that's actually not good. <laughs> Where the hell did it go? Come on. Could have got... Oh, God, there it is. Found it. Let me just go ahead and fish it out of my foot. It's okay, my feet are clean. More brand new socks. God damn it. Where's. What, oh, God damn it. Oh, whatever. I'm just gonna go ahead and do, have another empty bottle. Oh, there's one empty bottle over here. I can just reuse that. Make it a hell of a lot easier for myself. There you go. I like pulling new bottles just all around my room because I drink so much water. I did all the ones on Thalan. Nice. Let me see. There was one over here to the west that I gotta go do, and I actually accept. Let me see what that one's about. Well, I guess we'll just check out the rewards for now and see what it's all about before we continue with it in the first place. So let's see if you can find over here. There's one over here right there, in between all the soldiers and stuff. Back in the saddle, I wonder what that's all about. Let's go check it out over here. Hmm, where is it? There it is! Hello! It's Hillsbrand! Oh, it's Hillsbrand! Hello! I've never done this before! Hello, Mr. Hillsbrand! Uh, hi! A mild concussion will not sway Inspector Hillsbrand from his true calling. Apparently I found Mr. Hillsbrand and Nashu Karaka. Uh, verily, it could be nothing not else. Someone nearby this uh, dastardly uh, doings are afoot. You know, I can thwart them. That is... That's Hil That's Hildebrand. <laughs> that is Hildebrand, like one of the iconic characters in Final Fantasy XIV. The <laughs> I never seen him before until now. Okay then, <laughs> I seen like paintings of him, pictures of him around people's houses, and like, everybody constantly talks about Hildebrand and stuff. I was gonna accept all this then. I'm not sure what I gotta do for this guy, but he looks in tatters. I don't know why. And we got a quest accepted. Let's see, we gotta. What do we gotta do here? <laughs> We gotta go to Ulda, Steps of Nald, and I think, what do we got? Question the residence, that's what we gotta do. Alright, I'm just gonna side quest to do here. Not beast up, I'll look at it tomorrow, I guess. Yeah, sounds good. We can, uh, we can go level, low levels if y'all want. I'll be totally down for that. We go ahead and mount up my, which mount do I want to mount up? Uh, the ship? Yeah, we can mount the ship here. There we go. Uh, let's see, we can do, uh, let's see, sure, what classes are your lowest? My lowest class right now would have to be, uh, lowest, uh, Arcanus 10, uh, Conjurer, hmm, Conjurer, Thaumaturge, hmm, usually it says 15, so I could do those classes, technically. Hey, there you go, we all know airships here. <laughs> Oh my god, you haven't done the quest? No, I have no fear. That's actually the first time I ever meet Hildebrand. I hear about him all the time from a bunch of players and uh, from different updates and stuff like that, from Mr. Happy's videos and stuff like that, uh, pretty much just through YouTube. But I never actually seen him in game yet until just now. So I might be able to go uh, do his quest there. You need to do the Hildebrand quest line. I don't care, you're doing that today. <laughs> And you'll answer your canis and under whatever he has. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll be down for that. Let me just uh, do the Hidaban quest real quick. I guess I could just do it like a little bit of it before we do some of the low level stuff. I gotta just go over to the older area and just question some people. I guess I can start on it. Eventually I'll be able to do it. You wanna do it real quick? Alright then. <laughs> yes. I guess I'll just do it later in the stream then. Sounds good. <laughs> I'll just do it later in the stream. For now, we'll just level some of the low levels. I'll be fine. Let's see. Archer level and the rest of the class are at least 15. Gotcha. Alright, uh, we could probably do... Uh, like, I could do, go my, run my Arcanist. Uh, Sun could go run his Archer. And then 
Uh, Andre, you can run. Let's see. Do you have anything around level 10 main chance? Because if you have that, then technically we could run like small fate parties and then be able to do a guild has and stuff like that. Okay, I guess you both can be archers. Sure. <laughs> I guess you both can be archers then. We can just run that for a little bit. Just run a bunch of fate quests from top uh, for now. And, uh. Oh, uh. Sun can actually run Lancer as well. Yeah, he probably could do that. So I have two DPS, three DPS technically, uh, because I don't think, I believe actually, let me check actually, I think Arcanus is actually a DPS considered still, until you get the job for Scholar, I believe, not sure. Let me get a level 15, he could I guess, let's see. We just gotta get some to uh, 15 so we can run stuff. Yeah, we just gotta get some to level 15, because I have a class at level 15 that I'll have no problem running stuff with. It's just, uh, we wanna make sure we wanna get something bird up to, like, a, a level of 15, so we can actually, like, do dungeons and all that. <coughs> do it, you will die laughing. I will definitely do it towards the end of the stream, for sure, Afia. Like, not towards the end, but, like, in the second half of the stream, after we do some leveling. It's something you have to experience, I swear, it's something grand. Alright, get some, I'm looking forward to it. Hey, Michael, welcome to Steam. Oddly enough, I still can't get this game to work. Uh, what's wrong with it, buddy? Like, are you trying to run it through Steam? Are you trying to run it through Square Enix? Or is the game, like, not loading for you? Like, what was the, what was the problem with it at the moment? Because if there's anything I can do, like, if you have any questions, you can always ask me. I can maybe help you out? <laughs> maybe, possibly. Wait, didn't you say it was stuttering before for you? I think you said it was stuttering or something. Or I have level 17 Archer too, you could probably do that. Just gotta get someone to 15 so we can run stuff, yeah. Do you guys done so would be cool I guess, so we're not all the, all the same. Whatever works with me, to be honest. You just guys you guys just gotta make a decision now. Gonna get actually dismount this thing, cause here in the propellers all the time is getting a little bit obnoxious. Take a, take a different 15, you'll go Archer. Okay, cool. That sounds good. Welcome back, Worklight. Welcome back. We're currently doing a small uh, party here that we're trying to put together. I could do Conjurer. Actually, let me see if I can dismiss Chaser here, because if you're going to have a party, might as well dismiss him. Uh, we'll draw him real quick. I guess we could probably run a couple dungeons if he is level 17, we're 15. Yeah, you can run your uh, Marauder here, and we could uh, just like run dungeons or whatever. Let's go ahead and do that, actually. Let's go do our first dungeon. That's Shasta, right? Sastasha, God damn it! I keep getting the name of the dungeon wrong every single time. Also, we probably should not be in this area whatsoever. We probably should run away quickly because things are gonna try to kill us. Run, 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 quick! I'll heal you. I, I got you. I got you. Damn it! God damn it! Get out of here. <laughs> that was the worst thing ever. We probably should have moved immediately into a safe zone before we were gonna do the dungeons. <laughs> Not stand in the middle of the desert with level 34 enemies around. <laughs> are you going to be able to uh, come back there? Oh, there you are. Okay, cool. You go ahead and buff everybody. Can I use action at the time? Let me go ahead and map some things around so that I can actually use my offensive abilities as well as practice using my defensive abilities more often. There we go. Move it here. And we can do R for defenses like this. Actually, it's going to be more like buffs, if anything. I guess I could probably keep them like this. And we're here. Whatever. I'll just make them clickable. Shouldn't be too bad. There we go. Let me go ahead and put up the protection. Ah, I should probably make it a clickable anyway. There we go. Alright, so, uh, yeah. Uh, Andre, go for it and tank. You got it. <laughs> what did they get the personal airships in the game? Uh, where I this is actually something you get at, in Hammond's Ward as you complete the story and f do the story. It just, it's not something you gotta work towards. It just, eventually in the story, they just give you an airship and you fly around, and that's kinda cool. It's pretty sweet. I think you get a part of uh, completing every all the flying and atherite paths in the new uh, expansion maps and stuff. Just equip, uh, just equip flash sounds good. I should probably also equip something else as well, since let's see, I think I benefit from Thamaturge and Arcanist. Uh, Physic, let's see, restore target HP bonus of 400. That's the same thing. Uh, I think also can get something from Thamaturge. I could probably do Blizzard and do like an AOE. 
which does use bind on enemies. That's actually not bad. Next post, cast without interruptions. That might be something good to have. I should probably go ahead and put on the bars. Let's put it here. Uh, red check. Yep. I'm gonna go. I'm already ready. Let's do this. I'm totally ready for this. Also, we almost got all my codes here. We got almost a full Michael party. <laughs> I just realized that. There we go. Alright, time to try healing and not be derpy about it. Hopefully I can, you know, not fail with this. <laughs> First time officially healing in a game, so hopefully I can actually do decently well. <laughs> so if we got if you guys die, blame on me, because I'm the healer. <laughs> I know I want one. I feel so left out. Oh you get one eventually for sure. <clears throat> like I said, it's something that every single player gets at a certain point. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. <clears throat> I'm going to turn on the audio a little bit. There we go, a smidge. And turn up a little bit on the speaker so I can actually hear myself think a little bit. <laughs> Alright, cool. So, uh, as far as I understand, I think most of us know how this dungeon runs. You just pretty much take it, spang. Like, one of the easiest basic dungeons possible. But it should be pretty easy for us. Also, if you guys got food buffs, go ahead and use them because that will give us a lot of experience as we can level up through here. I don't have any with me. Kinda sucks, I probably should have grabbed some. Yeah, it's whatever. I got a Phoenix down, so I guess I could use that at a certain point. <laughs> Let me go ahead and heal up the Thamatorge over here. There we go. But overall, I think we're doing pretty well. What and uh, what next level can I get my abilities at? Let me check here. Actions. Asuna at level uh, 18, which will, let's see, a single detrimental target. Oh, nice. That's actually pretty cool. I don't think there's anything as bloody memento over there. We can just go ahead and run this way. There we go. Now, uh, no, go with Shurecast for now. All right. I currently have, yeah, I currently have Shurecast right now. I'm probably gonna be using this the entire time. I have zero food buffs. Yeah, I don't have any food buffs either. <laughs> I completely forgot to get. Them. Oh, we were in the middle of freaking desert, so it's understandable that I wouldn't have them in the first place. Oh god, let's go ahead and heal up Andre. There we go. There we go. Don't stand yourself, Andre. You do not want to stand yourself. That's a bad idea. <laughs> that usually is a bad idea. And Thamator just took some damage as well. Let me go ahead and heal him up as well. Ah, he's gonna be alright for now. Gotta heal the tank first. We go. Oh god. If that Thamator could maybe pop off some heal every now and then. You know, not every day. Hey, Nessa Flores, thanks so much for subscribing, buddy. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it. Welcome to the stream and welcome to the channel. In sound. Oh, the god damn it, this thing crashed actually. Oh, I don't want to say, guys. The uh, Steam Warrior program. Let me see if I can find it again and actually relaunch it. Let's see. Give me a moment, guys. Uh, one sec. There we go. One sec, guys. Sorry about that. Steam Warrior uh, app actually crashed. The one that alerts people off who subscribe. But anyway, Nathan, welcome to the Steam. Welcome, welcome. I think it's the some. Yeah, it's this thing over here. Let me see if I can find it real quick. Oh, uh, do, 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 do. let me see if I can. Oh, somebody's laughing at me. <laughs> I can hear him. Don't be laughing at me. I'm working my... <laughs> I'm trying my best here. <laughs> Don't you dare mock me. I'm trying my best. Let's see, let's go do this. Real time. Okay, good. And should be up and running now. Hopefully it should be running well this time around. Let's hope it actually works out well. Let's go ahead and put it back on live. And... Yes, it should be back. Okay, cool. Awesome. I'm back. Alright, let's keep on going then. I got this. See, I think we got all the protection. Yeah, we got all the protection we need. We are solid for now. <laughs> Until I end up lagging out and uh, not healing properly. Ah, oh, damn it, I pressed the wrong button, my bad. I think it'll be alright, though. <laughs> Still gotta practice pressing buttons every now and then. And also, Andre is now out of mana completely. I don't think real warriors use mana in the first place, so... I don't know. Maybe warriors do use mana? I have no idea. I never played a warrior myself or a marauder. Well, I have a Marauder, but I, like I said, don't have a Warrior. Love for this zero rotation for Archer at this level. Yeah, there's literally nothing. You just press, like, what, three buttons? That's it. <laughs> it's, like, the easiest thing ever. The most fun job ever, in my opinion, when there's, like, something easy to do for you. But it, for me, I'm just, like, what, like, I'm, like, a two-button hero, and that's it. I can only just spam one button for now. <laughs> I think pretty much every single class out there has some sort of, like, a one-button mechanic. Let me go ahead and actually do this here. Put up a dot in this thing. I'm gonna go actually stand next to Andre so it makes it easier to tank. And for him to tank. Because all the uh, all the ad aggro he can pick up easily from me.
No, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Okay, cool. Awesome. I'm trying to concentrate back on, like, how to heal again. I don't know. <laughs> it's been a while since I actually had to, like, focus on healing for a while. And now I'm back in this game, I'm like, first time healing in forever. Usually I don't heal in games, I usually tank or DPS, so playing as a healer role is a little bit different for me. It's more of like, I gotta watch the health bar and I can just watch my positioning instead of actually doing any damage. I'm using Manifold Flash? Gotcha. Yeah, I know, I mean, I know you can use uh, Manifold Flash, but I mean, Warriors in general and stuff. Matty K. V. Sto, uh, Koi Visto, Matty K. Visto, thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome to the channel, welcome to the stream, if you're watching the video, I uh, hope you enjoyed it. If you're watching the stream, feel free to say hello in chat, and welcome to the channel. Hey, Vigard, what's up, buddy? Welcome to the stream, welcome, welcome. Glad to see you here, buddy. Glad to see you here. How you doing? Also, I am very excited to play Cry Fear tomorrow. Still got that on the list, and still haven't forgotten for it. I made sure to actually set up a calendar. It's in the description to let you know on what games we are playing. Uh, also, there's a thing I'm doing where uh, you guys can vote on a particular game that we could do for. Uh <clears throat> Sorry, needed some water real bad. For the Valentine's Day stream, which is going to be this Sunday. Uh, the three games are. Somebody. Ha if somebody is on the mods could possibly post a straw poll, not the, not the mods that are in game right now with me, but anybody else, uh, that'd be awesome. If you could post the uh, straw poll, um, you could probably grab it from my Twitter or something. It's for Akiba Strip, which is just a stripping simulator in Akiba, or Akiba, Akibahara. <laughs> Akihabara? Yeah, Akihabara, or Akibagahara. Jesus Christ, oh, so many names. Japan, you strip people in Japan pretty much. <laughs> Or you can play, uh, let's see, there's also another game called How to Fall Boyfriend, which is just a pigeon dating simula uh, simulator, which is supposedly hilarious, I'm totally down for that. And then there's the Andrew simulator, which is just an all-around favorite. Let's go ahead and tag this thing. There we go. Sorry, not the best tank out here, I'm aware. Uh, no, you're doing fine, you're doing alright. You're not doing too bad. The idea with tanking is... In any game, aggro over damage. You want to make sure you grab all the aggro and make sure that the attention is on you for everything and anything. As, as a healer, ideally what I should be doing is standing pretty close to you in case I grab any other aggro so that you can peel it off of me pretty quick. Usually with AoEs and cleaves. If tanking is going to get a lot easier for most classes out there for any MMOs uh, as you continue to level up. So don't even worry about it for now. It's not going to be that big of a deal. And I'm doing good, Sam. I was pulling, uh, was pulling a very bad mood earlier, though, because of things. I'm sorry about that, bud. Uh, hopefully, we can cheer you up here. <laughs> hopefully, possibly. <laughs> as you can watch as I struggle how to prop, uh, properly heal in this game, even though I'm a terrible healer in most other MMOs. Uh, by the way, I saw... I don't go on Facebook often, but yesterday I went to uh, say happy birthday to my buddy. It actually was his birthday yesterday. He never really talks about... Uh, his birthday, so I end up forgetting accidentally. I felt kind of bad about it, and I end up seeing a video that you and like I think your friend did, where you guys danced or something. That was actually pretty hilarious. <laughs> Tham, Tham, Thorin, Andre, and Chaco, me. Yep, we got a uh, Sunfire Bird and Andre with me right now in the dungeon party. Uh, Andre is tanking. Uh, Sunfire Bird is DPSing as a bard or as an archer, and I'm just trying my best to heal and not die and not make sure that everybody dies. <laughs> That's about it. That's my entire job here. Thanks to easy later game? Yeah, I probably would be. But for now for me, oh god, I'm taking damage now. That's not good. <laughs> That's not good. Let's probably heal myself a little bit. Let's go ahead and do this here. Let's come back away slightly. There we go. Oh god, everybody's taking damage. Oh god, I know, I know what I can do. I know what I can do. There we go. AoE. Just AoE will look crazy. AoE will look crazy. Get everybody healed up. We're good. We're good. I can recover this. I can save this. <laughs> I will, and I can save this. I will try my best, and I paralyze as well. I got paralysis. We're gonna try to heal again. And just AoE, and I leveled up somehow. <laughs> I already leveled up. Holy crap! That was actually very impressive. <laughs> how are you, Sam? How are you all? I'm doing good. How are you doing, buddy? Uh, oh, you already said how are you doing. Uh, but <laughs> hopefully, yeah, uh, we can cheer you up throughout the stream. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. Let's see, let's go ahead and heal up here. Hey, with crazy heals? Yeah, it really does. Hope I can actually, like, abuse it in some way in later future. It doesn't seem to have drained too much mana from it, which is nice. Don't have to worry too much about it. There we go. GG level up? Yeah, thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Let's see, I'm gonna put a point into... Oh god, I probably should be healing my party member, shouldn't I? Uh, god. Hold on a sec. There we go. 
I gotta move the menu so I can actually heal people. Let's see, what am I gonna put point into? I think mind? Yeah, I think we can put point into mind now. Ah, uh, we can put into PD probably. Just make sure we get more mana in general. There we go. Let's go heal you up and get the giant clam. Gotta make sure we attack a little bit and nick it whenever it's possible for us. Go on the offensive because it's gonna end up spawning little ad fireflies around us. Let's go and A we heal real quick. We had a lot of fun as you can see. Oh yeah, you guys had a blast. <laughs> that was hilarious. Tank is blowing a lot of TP and not given a chance to get it back. Ah, because, I mean, I kind of did the same thing. It's, there's no way to recover TP at the moment, so I wouldn't really worry about too much. <laughs> Andre gets an advice. You're blowing a lot of TP and not given a chance to get it back. Yeah, you, pr you could probably take a break in between, like, the battles. As f now, what do we do more of this? Do it wrong for more XP? <laughs> I guess if you wanna. <laughs> Let's see, blue. I think it's blue coral formation that we gotta press. I'm not 100 sure. And since it's delayed, yeah, it's gonna be delayed for a while. So <laughs> all the message you guys are gonna receive is gonna be quite delayed. I think it's this one, the blue coral. You have something moving in distance. Then you can pick your switch. Let's go and press it. Oh, there we go. We got it. Go ahead and DPS this thing. Well, I've heard it a little bit. Okay, let's back away a little bit. Oh, now the archer is taking damage. Oh god, that's not good. <laughs> that's not good. Here you go. Here you go. <laughs> Here you go, something bird. I got your cover, buddy. Don't worry. I'll try to make sure we all stay alive. Even a little bit. And now the black mage is taking damage. Oh god. What the hell? <laughs> Everybody's taking aggro. Everybody's taking so much aggro. I'm gonna go ahead and try to heal the hell out of him. Come on, black mage. You can live. You can do it. I believe in you. <laughs> You got it! Just soak it in, buddy! Just soak it all in! Oh god, back away, everybody! Back away! Okay, we're good. Let's pop a quick AoE heal, just make sure everybody's covered. And the Black Mage is still being harassed. God damn it! <laughs> what a great tank here! What a great tank, ladies and gentlemen! Oh god! Jesus Christ! Ugh. <laughs> you see those glasses, then? Thank you, Bigard! I, my, I don't know, my contacts were just eating my eyes out and just really hurt. So I decided just to kind of take them off for now. And, um, uh, yeah. But thanks, I appreciate it. I don't usually wear them because, well, actually it's because I'm just lazy and don't keep them clean. <laughs> That's about it. I'm gonna go ahead and greet on those. And I think the doorway should be, there we go, inconspicuous <laughs> switch. There we go. That's what we gotta press. And now we go into the pirate cove underneath where the rest of the pirates are. By the way, we are actually in a freaking pirate cove right here. We got a bunch of reavers and stuff. Bunch of pirates just ready to fight, and something bird's about to pull somebody. No, you know, mine be good. <laughs> Never mind, Christ is averted. <laughs> Let's go ahead and do this here. Let's go away, move over here. Probably gonna take some aggro here, so I'm gonna go ahead and just A we real quick. There we go. Time to heal up Andre as best as possible. Hey, it's like a savior. Welcome to the stream, buddy. Welcome, welcome. Hope you enjoyed the stream. We're currently playing some Final Fantasy 14, leveling some level, low level classes, and uh. I'm trying to heal her for the first time in really ever. <laughs> ever in most and most out there. The only other heal I ever played was like World of Warcraft days, back when I played um, Paladin. I played a Holy Paladin uh, because I just generally like Paladin. I played all kinds of Paladin at the time. So I like everything and anything about Paladin. But now playing as a Conjurer, just mostly leveling stuff for the Arcanist. I would love to play as an Arcanist simply because it just looks like a very intricate and you wish class, so yeah. Also, the whole like cards and faith and stuff just sounds really interesting to me. I think we can just go through here now. Yeah, there you go. So nice and easy. Come on, something. Let's go in, buddy. All right. So the idea here. Oh god, he's already running in. <laughs> this, this is what I hate about. This is what I don't like about streaming. Whenever I play MMOs, things just jump around sometimes. But it's fine. It's whatever. We gotta kill the ads first before we kill the enemy, and then yeah. As long as we kill the ads before we kill the boss, we should be A-OK. -okay. I'm gonna go ahead and continue healing this way. See if we can do some damage here, like this. There we go, put up a little dot. Another dot, and continue healing. That's the best I can do right now. <laughs> feel like I'm backseat playing here. Oh no, don't worry about it, Fia. Don't worry about it. If you have any advice whatsoever, go for it. Feel free to offer anyway, especially when it comes to healing. Hey, Nathaniel. Uh, I don't know why I said your name like that. Nathaniel, welcome to the stream, buddy. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're having a great day, and uh, yeah, we're playing some Final Fantasy XIV for the night. How are you doing today? Let's go and heal up. There we go. But yeah, if you, if you got any tips whatsoever for healing, 
please let me know. Like, if, if, if there's anything I can do right now to, like, help the party, that'd be great. <laughs> I mean, I could probably, like, pop uh, arrow or something every now and then. I know that for sure. Just kind of not used to doing that yet. <laughs> Tell if it's okay to offer advice. Yeah, dude, also, uh, Andre says that it's okay to offer advice in tanking. So if you got any kind of advice whatsoever, uh, go ahead and give it to us. Archer stats? Uh, dexterity. Yeah, it's dexterity. It de is definitely dexterity. It's all, all the archer stats go into dexterity. Like, literally. If you're not putting uh, stats into dexterity, I don't know what you're doing. <laughs> There we go. Go and do this here. Yeah, we're gonna be taking some decent damage, but as long as I keep spamming healing, I should be fine. Oh god. <laughs> this is not coming out good. This is not going good. So, sure, guys, we'll make sure that I don't get interrupted, which is good. Keep it up. Come on, come on. <laughs> it's always these kind of clutch moments where I feel like my healing is just not enough, and I just gotta spam it at a certain point until, like, something good happens <laughs> I don't know maybe like I said I'm just not used to playing as a healer it will take me a while to fully get used to it say any trace unlocked it has medica grants 3% chance the medica will cost half MP I don't even have medic oh no I do have medica I do okay good I need a uh, eventually I'm gonna need to get like repos or something or stone or stone skin or maybe cure 3 cure 3 would be nice though that'd be definitely nice to have what about cure I guess cure 2 would just come with the job Go go over here. There we go. Let's go and put up a dot on the enemy. Come on, come on. There we go. Finally got to select them. Let's go and go into full uh, full pocket healer mode. That's like the easiest healing ever. I just press one button. Uh, Andre Ophia says uh, to have you pull Tomahawk overpower. And flash that should set haste. I don't think you can have a tomahawk right now at level 15. I'm not sure, but if you have tomahawk, uh, Afia says to do overhawk, overpower, and a flash in order to uh, set a nice uh, hate or aggro on you. That's Final Fantasy stream. Them uh, took a break from it, but might try. Uh, <laughs> sorry about that. I don't know what happened there. But it might be time to resub after watching these. Awesome, Daz. Well, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're enjoying this. It's just like low level leveling that we are doing here with uh, Andre and Sunfabird that are on the stream right now. Andre is tanking, and Sunfabird is the currently playing as an archer. And I'm just healing and trying to get used to healing just in general. See, with healing, in my most, I never heal, like ever. So I don't have a reason to. Uh, but this time around, I probably will give it a try. <laughs> Even a little bit. So we gotta go for one of these guys over here. I probably should have like I should make a macro. Uh, I should actually, I feel I should look up macros again and copy them over here in order to um, set up like who to kill, like the kill order and stuff. Because we made that one macro about like setting up markers and everything. I really like that. So I need to copy that over. Okay, set so as a fear suggested. Let's see if it improves. Awesome. Alright, okay. Yeah. At the same time, at low levels, things will you know will be harder to tank at the higher levels is going to be a lot easier because you're about able to generate as a warrior a lot of th a lot of threat and a lot of hate so wouldn't we'll worry about it. i guess we don't a full clear then <laughs> let's go here then i don't usually do full clears but every now and then some parties really want to do it i'm totally down for that though there we go I right, seems to be doing fine all right so far. Hey, Kurumi, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Also, easiest heals, play Scholar. Hey, Brett, welcome to the stream. I think you're actually playing as a um, Astrologian. That's what I like to play as. I might level Scholar later, but I want to get Astrologian up to level 50 at least before I can mess around with any other uh, jobs. But yeah, I would love to uh, try out uh, pretty much everything out there. Mostly start off with Astrologian. I'm gonna have to level Arcanus to a certain extent, I think. I think Arcanus is necessary for the... what is it called? We got a hole here. Nothing in a hole. We got the key, though. You unlock the door. There we go. Go in the hole here. And a bunch of uh, maidens all over the... <laughs> a bunch of maidens in the hole. Hello. Forgive me, my lord. I didn't mean to offend. Please, my lady. I'm ever so sore. Alright then. Damn, alright. They got, they got a bunch of maidens here. I don't know. I don't know how to feel about it. We got some earrings. Oh, intelligence, mind, and accuracy. I will take that. And I got the earrings. Nice. Okay. I'll gladly take them. Do I? There we go. There they are. I can go ahead and equip them like this. Nice. All right. Cool. 
Actually, Andre, I think we need this guy. Good loot for them? Oh yeah, definitely. I think we need to go here. Yeah, we need to go in here real quick. And uh, kill the captain. Was the key to the door again? Yeah, I was in the captain's quarter here. We gotta kill the captain to get to the uh, Weaver gate. Let's go ahead and set up the heal again. Also, Nathan, I'm doing great, Nathan. It's fine that you call me Nathaniel. My girlfriend calls me that. I haven't played any of the Final Fantasy games. Well, uh, this is actually a newish Final Fantasy game. This is an MMO take on the whole Final Fantasy universe, which I think works out pretty well. And if you never play Final Fantasy game, I'm in the same boat because I never grew up with Final Fantasy either. But I would say if you want to get like a game on Steam sale or something, go for it. Uh, some of the good ones out there is 7, 8, uh, 13 is an acquired taste, so if you really... I would watch somebody else's Let's Play of it before you get into it, or if you want to purchase it. Uh, but if you do want to get it, then go for it. Um, otherwise, most Final Fantasy games are really good. <laughs> Final Fantasy 14 is... A unique little snowflake because it's an MMO Final Fantasy game, which is kind of new to the Final Fantasy franchise. It plays a little bit like World of Warcraft if you've ever played that, so uh, if you want to try it, go for it. They actually have a free trial for it uh, for two weeks up to level 20, so yeah, have fun with it. And the Black Mage is taking damage. That's not good. Let's probably also move back a little bit. And the guy is already dead. Okay then. That makes our job a hell lot easier. Alright then, we're done. <laughs> we are solid. That was actually pretty awesome. It's level 15 skill. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. I think I think Andre got it right now. Yeah, it seems I mean, I seem to not have no problem uh not taking aggro, so it's nice. <laughs> I think it's working out pretty well. It's my this is my first time tanking to be honest. Well you seem to be doing alright so far. I mean, you know, so far so good. <laughs> it's first time healing for me, really. My best friend has a macro for when uh, something important is happening. The danger bongos. <laughs> well, you're gonna have to link it to me because that actually sounds like a really fun macro. <laughs> Skull is basically a summon fairy and AFK pre-30 when you get harder content. It becomes a matter of balancing your heals and DPS if you get to that point. Alright, sounds good. I mean, eventually I want to level up every single class out there. Like, every single, every single job available and every single job possible. I will be able to level up all of them immediately, but eventually I'll get to them, and I'm actually uh, not doing so well. I'm having trouble healing there. Uh, please pop defensive. Oh god, I'm totally... I'm screwed, please. Guys, kill the number one, number three adds. Just kill them real quick. Don't attack the main dude. That's the last thing we should be doing. I'm gonna pull up a dot on him. Also, we're gonna have dogs coming up from the left. I remember this dungeon pretty well, so... Uh, Everybody prepare your butts for it, because things are gonna end up happening bad. <laughs> bad things are gonna end up happening. I can't even speak at the moment. <laughs> oh, wait, don't worry about that. Any archer advice, or is it easy? It's easy. Simply just do your rotation, make sure you have a crit buff on all the time, and uh, you're good. The straight shot ability, and that's about it. It's like the easiest possible job at the very beginning, or profession. As a job, though, you actually have to like find times to do your own... I don't know, especially in Heaven's Ward, with the Wanderer's Minuet and stuff, it definitely becomes something different, something of its own, for sure. I'm gonna go ahead and stand in here with everybody else. So I should probably cast out Protect just to make sure we get all the buffs again. Okay, let's go ahead and AoE heal real quick. And the Thamatorge is dying. Ugh, that's not good. <laughs> that's not good at all. I'm gonna go ahead and heal him real quick. Make sure he doesn't die on us. There you go, bud. You'll be fine, don't worry. You'll be alright. I got everybody healed up. I'm looking out for health. I'm, you know, trying to be as productive about it and watchful as possible. <laughs> I'm running a little mana though, so that's, uh, that's not good. <laughs> and they're finally dead. Okay, good. Whew, that was actually getting clutch close. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> and look at that. We got ourselves a uh, hat. I would love to get the hat, but at the same time, I have the friendship circlet. I guess I... Nah, I'm gonna greet it. The, if the uh, Black Mage wants it, they, he can have it. I'm gonna read the hat for now, though. Because I still have the Friendship Circle, and I kind of want to keep it. Which grants me extra experience, and to helps me level up in general. Wow, I'm in love with this monitor uh, colors. Looks so damn good on it. Got a new monitor? Oh, nice. Wait, did, yeah, I th wait, did, I think I told me about you got a new monitor. Oh, wow, yeah. If you're talking about the calls of the stream, though, uh, I'm currently running a Sweet Effects 
uh, or Master Effect, technically, uh, pretty much similar to Sweet Effects, if you've ever heard of that, on Final Fantasy XIV, which makes the colors a little bit juicier. I could try to turn it off if I remember the hotkey for it, but yeah, I don't know. Just the way Final Fantasy XIV looked at first, I liked it, but the new overlay kind of looks like an Instagram filter, which makes things look a little bit more juicy, a little bit more bright, a little bit more vibrant. And you guys should still technically, yeah, you should be able to see the colors at the moment as well on the stream. I, mean, I set it so that it would actually like show up the colors. I think. Hopefully it does. <laughs> I mean, I never know. Maybe it doesn't. I, what I, from what I see here on the preview, it seems like it's the same thing, but it's whatever. <laughs> I should probably say heal myself a little bit. I'm completely disregarding myself here. Healing everybody about myself. <laughs> There goes, do some attacks here. Let's do some damage. At least some, if anything. There we go. And now, some people are in the same position as I used to be. Just run around, do your little dancing pirouette. <laughs> While trying to run away from the ads. Don't spam Q so much for uh, it's killing your MP. Well, at the same time, I need to spam at a certain point because like people are dropping health. <laughs> I'm undergeared here <laughs> completely. If only, oh, maybe I could probably equip some of this stuff. No, it's all strength and all that. Can't have any of this at the moment. Now, I, see, I don't have anything that can help me improve in my healing ability. So the only thing I can really do is just kind of just keep spamming things over and over and over until I get somewhere. <laughs> Did I level up? I no, I don't think I leveled up. No, I didn't level up just yet. I think uh, no, I think Andrew maybe leveled up. Yeah, I think he might have. Let's do this. Oh Jesus Christ, this is not gonna be good. Go and try to do this. I have to spam Q as much as possible. I could wait until he's like half health, but that makes me way too nervous. And I leveled up, apparently. I didn't know I did that. <laughs> Yay, level up! Not bad. That circle is actually helping me out a lot. It's pretty awesome. There we go. I think we're good here. Yeah, we should be good. We gotta clear this set of ads and we should be getting to the boss. Now, the boss, at first when I did it, I didn't know what to do, but... <laughs> I kind of cut up the mechanics pretty easily. I don't know, in Final Fantasy XIV, I like how they ramp up the difficulty from like, easiest dungeons, like, oh, it's, you know, it's not a big deal. And then hardest dungeon, it's like, oh, you have to, like, look out for everything. And like, Alexander Savage, oh, Jesus Christ. It's fun, but it's like, oh my god, so much stuff you gotta look out for. Now, use cure about half your, um, use cure about half your tank HP unless you fight a boss. Okay, I mean... I don't know what else I can spam to heal, I only have Cure to, as a healing spell. I get the AoE one, but I doubt that one will conserve mana as well. When he drops at half health, it makes me really nervous, so I just want to keep spamming it. It's kind of be a lifeline here. Let's see, this will actually use uh, 45 MP, while the other one will use 16 MP. I have to end up using it at a certain point, like, I, uh, I'm just gonna have to spam it for a while here. Yeah, I guess we could try to go a little bit on the offensive. Maybe that could work out and help me out in a little bit. So take some up some MP. Go ahead and skip through that. Don't have to worry about that. All right. So I think what I'm gonna do is actually stand near the, um, I guess one of the unnatural ripples, or probably one of the closer ones, so I can get them real quick. And I think everybody is actually protect. Let me just go ahead and reapply just in case. It's not gonna get everybody, is it? Oh, well, we got three people. That's about it. Uh. Some people didn't get but protect. I'm gonna go ahead and replay protect them real quick. Okay, cool. I think what I'm gonna do is come over to the closer one. You get you, the range can stay at range. It's actually pretty fun. Hopefully it works out well. <laughs> Let's hope for the best. Prepare for the worst. If this one gets if this one starts bubbling up or the other one starts bubbling up, then I will run over to them. I'm gonna be watching off them very carefully. Very, very carefully. Oh, don't have to cast at the point right now. Oh, there's something at uh some ripples are happening, right? Are they happening over here? No, we're good. I think no, no, we're good. We get here. The other party members gotta look out for the ripples if they ever see any. Oh, oh god, never mind. Oh god, he's actually taking damage. He heal up a little bit. Okay, right, cool. Go ahead and run over here. Stay alive, stay alive. I'll go ahead and close this out. 
Okay, good. Whew. Whew. Okay, keep spamming cure. Sack mine if make a cure hit harder. Alright, I'll make sure to start doing that. Oh, jeez, I'm not healing you. My bad, my bad. That was my bad. That was so my bad. Res you, res you, res you. Can I res you? Is it gonna let me res you here? Oh, my in battle right now. Can I use you in battle? God damn it. I'm sorry. I bet it was actually my bad. That was my. That was absolutely my bad. And any approaches. Shit. That was my bad. I wasn't even targeting you at the time. That was terrible. And yet the guy is actually almost dead. Holy crap. Alright. See if we can go on a full offensive here. And the uh, back mage is dying. I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can heal him up a little bit. There we go. And now I'm dying. Guys, get him! We can do this! We can do this! Just keep going up against him! We got this! <laughs> oh! Whew! I don't know how we did this. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> that was completely my bad. <laughs> Here's the thing. I went to go touch the thing and I completely stopped targeting uh, Andre and that's why he ended up dying. So this was all on me. Like literally, everything, every single thing was on me. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and give a less here combination of four dealing with us and I got the pair of boots I'll gotta take those gladly where they're at oh maybe, maybe some boots that I got gloves that's what I got here uh, where that there we go there they are we go and equip them oh look nice actually kind of nice of me I like this <laughs> well then I guess we should probably also exit the place and then as soon as we go to the desert switch to a high level class so we don't get attacked by things <laughs> So that my high speed internet is annoying the piss out of me. It's so damn slow. <laughs> I'm sorry Nathan. I'm sorry about that bud. I'll be right back when it starts being a little piece of crap. It could be also on my end. It doesn't have to be always on your end. Like here's the thing. I don't have a good internet. It's alright. It's good. But it's not reliable. I don't know why. <laughs> but whatever. Yeah, we should probably go ahead and move from here as soon as possible. Let's go and do this. I just uh... Let's tell you out of here. Or something. We should probably tell out of here or something. Maybe. Is that supposed to heal people or? I have no idea what you're doing. This is the wind. Oh, movement speed increase. Gotcha. Pick a city. Oh, God. What city can we go to? Uh. All the works. Yeah. All the work. Let's see. Let's go ahead and find all here. Uh, Thanalan. All the There we go. Now I just wait for you to teleport. It should activate for us as well. There we go. Oh. There we go. I like how in a party if one person teleports and the other people can just instant teleport after them. That's a really cool like thing. I like that. I think we could maybe run a guild house or something to make it a little bit easier for us. Something we haven't ran yet. At least I haven't run any guild house whatsoever on this class, so it'd be pretty fun to run something on that. Like a level 15 guild hest. Let me see if I can find some like that over here. We can run some of them. Actually, some of the level 25 as well for some reason. Oh yeah, because I'm playing as the other class right now. There we go. So show to Conjurer. And there you are, Andre. There you go. Yeah, guild hest would definitely be a great idea. Also, uh, food buffs. We gotta get food buffs immediately. That's a priority. That is a must. We have to have those. Otherwise, I completely forget about them. They are a must. I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can get myself some food here. I think it's going to be any other area over there, across from the place. I'm not going to do any of the witness quests just yet. Uh, for... God, what, what's the name again? Uh, to, 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 Hillbrand. Yeah, I'm not going to do any Hillbrand quest uh, stuff just yet. I'm going to go ahead and get the food and we could probably run some guild hests as well. Let's go ahead and do that. And I believe that's the only place to really get food is either through the, uh, the Adventurer's Guild. Maybe. I know the market definitely has food. Not sure about any other places. They have just like repair places and places you can just buy regular gifts, but that's about it. Not gifts, uh, armor and stuff again. Sorry, I'm buffed. <laughs> it's okay. It's all good, Andre. Because, you know, level my coloring or some. Gotcha. I, I never level any kind of <laughs> food or professions ever. Hmm. Let's see. One of the people here should be the one with the food. Trick that merchant, no apothecary, no pot watch. That might be uh, might be who I'm looking for here. Pot watch, are you the one with the food? Uh, yes, you are the one with the food. Hmm. 
I could sell some of this stuff that I'm not gonna need. Max Ether, I guess I could keep that. Max Potion, I guess I could keep that. I don't know. Uh, we could probably move this stuff like this here. There you go. All the trivial things that are not necessary need right now go here. And I could have some, uh, some food. What can I have here? Perfection recipe, GP, gathering, CP, control, craftsmanship, determination, battalion, accuracy. That's kind of stuff I need here. Let me see if I have anything for... Um... Critical hit, battalion accuracy, piety, I don't need that. Accuracy would be nice. Is there anything that can let me cast faster? Determination, vitality, accuracy, skill speed, not cast speed. Spell speed, there we go. Spell speed, vitality, and accuracy. Some raisins would be wonderful. Let's have some raisins here. Let's take like 10 raisins. There we go. There we go, I got my raisins. I'm good. <laughs> Boil deck for crit? I'm guessing so. Yeah, I, I'm gonna go ahead and pop my raisins here. There we go. <laughs> I'm all well fed. See, I love the food in this game. Like, no matter what food you get, it's extra more experience just in general. So it actually makes you kind of want to go out of the way and, like, for a quest to us up food or, like, go into the shop and, like, get some kind of food or something. It's pretty awesome. I don't think I have any of the mind. I don't think there's any food with mind there, but I guess I'll just kind of stick with this one now. Let's see. What guild has can we do for now, though? We could probably do here of the half shell. I'm yet to do. Oh, excuse me. I'm yet to do basic training enemy, enemy strongholds. I guess you could probably do these real quick. World well, raisins for magic and egg for melee. Gotcha. Uh, Afia said. Uh, let me see, actually right here. Afia said. Friends for magic, eggs for uh, melee. There we go. All right. Let's go ahead and join in the guild hest. Let's see if we can queue in for one. Hey, there you go. Look at that. That was actually pretty damn fast. Let's go see if we can do uh, two of them. And that will give us a decent amount of experience. Hopefully, we'll get to level 20. We can do the next set of guild hests. And maybe another, we'll unlock another set of dungeons or something. We'll, do, we'll get something done for sure. <laughs> and we got ourselves a another tank. Oh, you're playing as a monk right now, aren't you? Oh, yeah, you are playing as a monk. We're a three-man party. <laughs> Except you're not doing much. Except you, I, I, except you're playing as a monk right now. You're not playing as a tank. That makes it really fast. <laughs> well, I guess we got another tank then. Let's go ahead and buff him real quick. Tank and heal DPS. Except Andre is not a tank right now, and I'm taking damage. Um, help, <laughs> help me. <laughs> That was my bad. I should have waited for you to uh, switch class. So take eggs? Yeah, you'll take the eggs, even in Zarcher, apparently. Because eggs would give you, like, crit or something, which is actually pretty damn good. Let me actually check your buff here. Uh, for you, it gives a crit, which is really good. But Tauri is not bad. Accuracy is good as well. Let's go and do this here. And then I can get these guys over here in the back. Let's go and do this here. Gonna attack him right now. Do some AoE heals. There we go. Let's get this guy over here as well. 220, go for it. No, it's so good. You wanna be that's here's the thing. When it comes to Gissel Greens or right, Gissel Greens, right? That's what it's called. Yeah. Gissel Greens or food, take as much of it as possible. Like right now, on me, I currently have three Gissel Greens, but it started with 50, and I kind of just kept them there. <laughs> Never had a reason to not have them, and I just like having them at this point. I probably should grab a Black Mage's uh, Blizzard in order to do some AoE damage, I think. Maybe that might be beneficial? I don't know. I don't know how hard we'd be able to hit it without level. Can I push this yet? No, I can't. Not yet. Let's see, anybody taking damage? Oh, somebody's taking damage there. I think it'll be fine though. Let's go pop a quick AoE heal. Never mind, I'm paralyzed. Can't even do that. At low levels, you can't ask for much food. Uh, you can use. Yeah, you, at low levels, you won't be able to get a lot of food. Which is why, when I was leveling, whenever there was like a quest reward that was really good food, I always just grab the food. It's so good. It was like really, really good though. When this end, the tank is about to take some damage there. Never mind, he got stunned. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. Gonna go ahead and run back here. There you go. Let's 
so I don't have to worry about ads too much. Actually, I might be a little too close to the frog there. <laughs> the boulders begin to crack. Can I heal the boulders? What if I can? Never mind, I can't. <laughs> can't heal the boulders. My guys got him. Gonna put up a down on him. I guess I could probably attack him for a little bit. Do some extra damage. Just a little bit, if anything. Let's keep attacking. Don't worry about me. I'm good. I'll be fine. I just dodge him a little bit. There we go. Awesome. Give combination to the tank. Let's go and get some quick experience. It's like the easiest way to level new classes. I absolutely love doing guild has and stuff. Which there were like actually like guild has I can do. Uh for uh I don't know, for like oh God, what was what what am I trying to say here? For like, I don't know, level 50 to 60, that'd be amazing. If they could like introduce guild has and stuff. But they apparently they don't have them after that. <laughs> Let me go back to my uh, Marauder. Yeah, sounds good. Let me see, did I get anything good? Uh, no, I don't think I got anything much here. Let's see, uh, still level 17. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, do the... What is it called? Let's do the other one here. The other guild has. Hero the Half Shell. There we go. And quick use because we got a tank here on DPS. Just have one extra DPS. <laughs> We're pretty much carrying whatever DPS that joins us. Or they're carrying us if they're good. Now this one should be pretty easy. All we gotta do is tank and spank the turtle for a bit, kill all the adds, wait until the turtle is like at half health, and then get the flame spirit, and then kill that. Use a flame spirit on a pack of I think it's plants, and then bring the turtle over to the plants to stun it. And that's it. This shouldn't be too bad. And we got ourselves a uh, an assassin? Yeah, I think an assassin. Oh yeah, definitely that's an assassin. Go put up protect. Sweet. Yeah, we gotta uh, set the herb patch, the herb patch on fire. As soon as the flame spirit up appears over here. All right, let's do this. Uh, I'm gonna try to practice doing some damage myself as well. Oh yeah, we're playing as a rogue, aren't you? No. Oh yeah, it's it's not assassin just yet. It's wait, is it considered a rogue technically? Let me check here. I gotta hold on. <laughs> oh yeah, it is a rogue. Okay, gotcha. My bad. My bad on that one. There we go. Let's go and attack the enemy real quick. Make him real quick. Make the boss real quick. So there's another enemy over there behind him. The amateur raider. Let me go ahead and oh back away. There we go. Put up dot in him, put up a dot in him as well. Real quick, and we're good. Nice. It's gonna be the easiest thing ever. Let's go use this to make sure we get both the tank and the rogue over there. Never mind the rogue didn't get much. I'm stuck between choosing aura. Uh, male or uh, cat Malk with my potion? What do you mean? Let's go and do the quick AOE. What? Why am I doing quick AOE? I can just pop Q real quick. <laughs> there we go. Gotta get to half health, and at that point, there was some of the add on one of the hills. Let's go and do that real quick. Come on, come on, little ad. Come on, little flame thing. Get out of here. <laughs> you can do it. There we go, finally. See, let's go for the fire spirit here. I got mail with my magic potion. Oh, yeah, I mean, up to you, actually. Uh, up to you if uh, if you want to use that. Oh, not to that. That's all it's up to you if you want to use that. He obtained a fire spy, uh, fire spark core. I'm gonna go ahead and place it here. Trigger the trap. All right now, bring it all the way here. Let's bring it all the way here, all the way to the trap. A little bit more. Come on, just a little more. There you go. What I usually do when I play as a tank is just literally like carry it all the way through it and run past it. Make sure it runs in between that thing. Do, 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 do. Love it. 
the music the final fans music is all like at this point for me it's becoming a little bit iconic which is kind of uh kind of nice because like granted i'm late to the you know the whole final fantasy thing <laughs> i'm finally like oh my god i can actually like recognize this i can feel i can feel this it's nice <laughs> I'm almost level 10 as well, which will allow me to unlock a Dispel. Pretty much a Dispel like ability. I guess that's what they're called in World of Warcraft, just a Dispel. Uh, let's see, is that anything I can currently implement right now that could benefit me by any chance? Foresight, no. Featherfoot, no. Second one might be nice just to have because it just would heal me up a little bit. I don't know if Eternal Lace will critical hit in general. Does critical hit even help me in, in the first place? Uh, Fixes the rate at which you physical and magical attacks deal critical damage or restore critical HP, as well as the amount of critical damage dealt or critical HP restored. Ooh, not bad actually. Might be really, really good. Flash, no. Nope, fuck, no. Com uh, convalescence, no. Lancer, uh. Don't think so. No, you know what? I'll probably. Oh, sorry about that, guys. Uh, I'm going to do this here. Had a long day. Morning classes are terrible. I'm finally starting to feel the morning class displeasure because like at that point I feel just a lot more fatigue throughout the day. There's one or two more GHs, right? Or they're not worth it. We could try Temtara. Uh I am down to try any GHs. Let's see. Uh is there a dungeon we can do? Oh we could do Temtara Deepcraft. Uh, let's go ahead and do that real quick. Let's go do uh Deepcraft here. And give that a go. Deepcraft actually drops a really, really cool looking coat that I absolutely love. And when I got it on my first bard before I came over to this server, I freaking loved it. Like, I don't know what server I started on, then I went to over to Exodus and made my final character. But I got a coat from this place that looks freaking cool. It looks like a, an awesome uh, jacket with like leather and chains and stuff. It's like red and white. It looked absolutely amazing, I loved it, and I missed it so much, and I finally got it again after like leveling an alt through this dungeon at a certain point, and it was amazing. I took the summoner first heal spell as my third job ability for now, and nothing better. <laughs> Hello, Alistar. There we go. Alright, let's do this. We got ourselves a lancer, we got ourselves an archer, marauder, and a me. The terrible, terrible healer. <laughs> the not so good healer. There we go. See, I already got more food buffs, so I should be a okay. Just gotta get to level 18. I should be able to dispel stuff. Then I'm gonna have to start watching out for that. I could. Oh, I already have the uh, critical buff. Never mind, I'm good. <laughs> I could use that on bosses now. That'd be pretty amazing. Not whenever somebody's dropping health. There we go. Change the phase shift. Sounds good. What all works for you? Yeah, what all works for you? Let's see, you're good here. Okay, cool. And level up. Nice. Congrats. Alright, let's go through here. We're always, almost like level 20 at this point. Coming up pretty close. We're coming up really, really close. We're like inching our way towards level 20. I don't know how I cannot like not spam cure here because like I'm just literally sitting here. The hell is dropping, but I'm like I need to like heal him up somehow. If I just stand there, there's not much, not much I can really do. And I even leveled up. Hello. I can now put point into mind and make sure that my healing spells do a lot more healing. <laughs> there we go. That was actually perfect. Like, he, like, that level up came at a perfect, perfect time. Love it. <laughs> I have a full set of level 20 gear waiting for me. That got crafted for me. Nice! That's actually really cool. I need to start getting into crafting so I can make myself subsets. <laughs> That'd be amazing. Because otherwise I'm like running around like a bum, just hoping like, Oh, please, poor sir. Like, please, can sir. Give me something. I need something out there. Let's go and place it here. Go. Let's see. Uh, we're good on protect. At this point, this is like the part where 
Like, here's the thing, I love when it, like healing stuff gets clutch close because I feel like I'm actually participating in stuff and very active, but whenever, you know, just really easy ads are being tanked, it's like, I can just kind of sit here and just chill back, just, you know, relax a bit, grab myself water or whatever. Ugh. Maybe just my back a little bit, because that's starting to hurt again. Lovely. I think it's all starting because of, like, the change in weather and everything. It got really, really cold all of a sudden. Hello, people in free company. My TP recovery. <laughs> can't speak. Now my TP recovery. Yeah, sounds good. Total down for that. I think eventually you can, uh, if you have a Lancer, what you could do is actually grab the ability from Lancer. Did I attack? Never mind. Never mind. It's the uh, Lancer that attacked. Or somehow pulled aggro. There we go. Let's help him out a bit. Uh, but something you can actually grab from a Lancer job, which allows you to recover TP, which I think is a freaking godsend when it comes to playing as a bard, or any like melee out there that needs TP a lot. Sadly, not all of them will be able to have it. Only like Monk and like, yeah, only Monk and what is it called? God, I completely forgot. <laughs> Monk, Warrior, and uh, Bard benefit from it. More than not the best tank around, if you want me to tank without TP or MP, we're doomed. <laughs> I think we'll be, you know, we'll be okay. I, I trust us. I trust us to do decent. Not the, not the best, but not the worst. I'll level up Lancer a bit to get the move ready when I'm Bard. Awesome, sounds good. Uh, something Bard. Are you going to be playing mostly Ninja or are you going to be playing mainly Bard and just kind of Ninja on the side? Like, which class is going to be mostly your main? Because if you're going to be playing Bard, I can tell you all stuff about Bard, just ask you questions. Ninja! I hardly know stuff, so <laughs> I'll be the last person you want to ask. Good tag this for a little bit. Actually, I could probably just use this to kind of like AoE heal us real quick. The ninja on the side. I think I'll go Bard. Alright, sounds good. But if you have any questions whatsoever, then you're more than welcome to. Yes, I am. <laughs> I'm still so streaming. I think they weren't talking to me there. Oh, they were talking to me. Sorry, I didn't see your message there. My bad. <laughs> I'm gonna make, actually expand the chat a little bit more so I can focus a little, a little bit more on that. Let's go through here. I'm good on healing here for now. Hopefully, nah, I'm not coming tomorrow. I was thinking maybe I could move the face cam a little bit over, but I think I'm not uh, gonna be that bad. It's not gonna be that bad. I'm not recovering much. Just covering the XP bar and the gill. That's about it. Alright, so is you ready, Andre? Okay, good. Go ahead and give you a quick heal up. Let me check my corners and grab the loot over here. Nice. My main is level 202 Paladin, 195 Astrologian, and 193 Ninja. Nice. I hear Paladin are pretty damn good for raiding right now. It's like Paladin and Dark Knight, and Warrior don't really do much. Maybe Warrior do do more like than Dark Knight, I don't know. As far as I understood, like, Dark Knight was kind of climbing out to be like the new meta for raiding, but I don't know what it's gonna be like at this moment. It's probably also do some. DPS just a little bit there to help out. There we go, pitch in a little bit. I would do some mind. Why? Why don't you look at my uh, soulless eyes? If I can't see the soul in your eyes, then I can't look at your eyes very like I don't know. We all are twisted in a little in a way. I mean, all of us are twisted in some way or another. I mean, hell, for me, <laughs> it's just Cago <can't> Central. <laughs> just <can't. laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm here for Blood for Blood. Nice. Oh, got. There we go. Blood for Blood is something you get from a Lancer job, and you get it at level 34. Damage uh, dealt, but take more damage for a bit too. There we go. None of this because I'm deciding yet what my second main will be. Uh, let's see, white mage or warrior? Gotcha. 
adds insane DPS power. It does add insane DPS power for sure, but at the same time you end up taking damage. So you feel like, I don't know, fighting the boss whenever the boss is like bursting on you or doing a huge AOE, you end up taking a lot more damage. Increased damage dealt by 10, and damage suffered by 25. So it kind of has some trade off. But it's damn good though. It's definitely damn good. But taking a Fininja, it might be a good thing to take Fininja, yeah, definitely. Let's see, we got all the boss, good. Now we just gotta get a quick add, and we're good. After that, we got a bigger add. <laughs> what Warriors wreck everything? I. Here's the thing though, uh, Ophelia, I'm not specialist when it comes to like. <laughs> when it comes to like the tanking meta for Final Fantasy XIV, which is why I don't know. Now I know. <laughs> I was thinking of leveling a warrior after leveling the uh, Astrologian or after leveling you know, Dark Knight for a little bit. Just getting the warrior off because just the warrior playstyle looks really, really cool. Oh, wrong ability. There we go. That sounds good. Good, good, good. I'm gonna chill back here for a little bit. Okay, now we got a proper heal. Be a really good time to heal now. Yeah, that may be a really, really good time to heal right about now. It's gonna heal a little bit more. Come on! Almost got him! Almost got him! Very close! <laughs> very close. I was trying to be a bit creepy and dark there. I just do very close, but you know me, I kinda like to brighten things up a little bit. <laughs> Let's see. Paladin. Yep, that's uh, for Andres, not for me. What's the answer? Ability to recover TP. That is. Let me check on that. Uh, invigorate. Uh, level twenty-two. Oh, not two to two. Twenty-two. There we go. Gonna get that? Yeah, it's probably gonna be necessary for you to get that. A uh, warrior is the only tank that can get the DD output. Nice. Yeah, I know warrior is definitely like it's known as a meat shield. The same time it's known as the one that's like able to do actual like damage and competitive damage among all the tanks. Yes, as far as I understood, it wasn't the best, but it wasn't the worst either. I don't know. It was a whole thing where uh, the, there was a podcast with Mr. Happy, and he was doing it with other uh, Final Fantasy XIV YouTubers and or streamers. And what they were talking about was how Paladin was pretty much secured a main tank spot, and the optic was usually either a Dark Knight or a Warrior. And apparently in Heaven's Ward, Dark Knight started making a slow, but sort of like a decent. I guess advanced towards getting like a solid off tank spot compared to warrior. I don't know. They were having a discussion about it some time ago. Maybe the meta has changed those recent. I would have no idea. I'd be the last person aware about it. Can I boom now? Game. Oh, somehow it's stabbing out. Oh god, run away. We're going to kill up everybody. Took a little bit of damage here. There we go. So, Paul, guys, uh, are a male or cat, male or female? What do you? Uh, what do I pick with my potion? If you want to go are male, go for it. They're actually pretty awesome and towering. Oh, that's what happened. I was in chat. That's what it is. Uh, if you want to go with cat, male, go for it. I mean, you can kind of see what Andre's character is like and be like, if you want, you know, if this is something you want to go with, go for it. Me, I mean, you know my answer. I mean, what what other answer would I have? my cat that's it <laughs> that should be a very easy answer at this point so already know what I will be picking there I play things because they're fun to play with sounds good sounds good Andre man some from bird honestly just go with whatever looks cool and awesome to you if an R male looks awesome then go for it if uh, a cat male looks awesome go for that you already know my answer though and I'm very biased. <laughs> you know, I just got a thing for cat girls. That's about it. I can never choose. I can never change my answer at that point. I work like those are just the races in the game. Aura are the new Heaven's War races that were added. The dragon-like people. Uh, cat male is like the my coat male. And uh, Andre's taking some damage there. Oh god, I probably should be pumping out health like crazy. I know my man is almost gone now, but I'm just gonna push it out. I'm just gonna keep on pushing it. There we go. We go over here. Heal up again.
Nice. Let's keep going through here a quick sec. All right, cool. Sounds good. Yeah, we gotta recover some TP for you. So I'm gonna go ahead and back my way into here and just check the place out. Okay, we got a couple of uh, mightnings. Don't have to worry about that. Reload if you lost the stream. If you lost the stream. Uh, yeah, guys, for some reason, what's going on here with YouTube Gaming is that sometimes streams crash, right? I don't know what it is with YouTube Gaming, but sometimes stream just started crashing all of a sudden for some people. Uh, actually, I was experiencing yesterday as well. I was watching my buddy uh, Steve play, and his stream constantly would crash for me. I just reload if necessary and then it goes back so yeah there's a treasure wait where's the treasure at Let's see we go ahead and go over here see if we can find it. oh it's over there on the other side okay gotcha all right i'm totally down for that let's go get the treasure real quick let me go ahead and recast this though there we go got it right in time let me go get up the treasure real quick oh look at this what do we got here i'm gonna check out in a bit uh, let's see, Intelligence, Critical Strike, Mind... Ooh, that's for me, that's totally for me. There we go. That's just more loot to add to my collection. I think I pretty much win, even with a 4 roll. There we go. So what is this? I think this is actually a wrist. No, it might be a neck. This is a, a wristband. Nice. Do -do 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 -do. Let's see. Wrist. There we go. Go ahead and add that. Not bad. I'm finally getting equipped with some decent gear now. Oh god. Oh god. Come on. Forgot I'm not a tank. <laughs> My bad. My bad. Uh, please ignore that. <laughs> I totally did not mean to face pull the entire room there. Totally not. There we go. And Andrew takes some damage there. Oh god. That's not good. <laughs> Andrew, if you can hear me, uh, there's some gladiator abilities you can grab. Uh, one of them is called Convalescence, which is actually really good. It increases HP recovery via healing magic by 20% for self. Meaning, like, if you start taking a lot of damage, you just pop that, and then my heals will be a little more potent on you if you want to grab that. It's like a level 10 skill, Convalescence. Uh, you may have it at a certain point, but who knows. Too busy looking for the new shinies. <laughs> maybe a little bit, maybe a tiny little bit. Let's see, what else we got over here? Now we got a, uh, hey, look at that, DPS uh, pantalones. I can't grab, I can't grab these, but I'll let you guys have them. I thought I would be the healer for the group. I am on the same time as the rest of you. You, you probably could be the healer. I mean, if you want to be a DPS, you can, but... <laughs> but if you want to be the healer, you can. I could probably step down from the heal position, play something else. I mean, I got plenty of other classes to play for myself, personally. I got a Thamator I could play. Yeah, easily, no problem. Let's go and do this here. And I'm going to take some damage. I'm going to go ahead and run over to you here. There we go. Go pop real quick in AoE. And I gotta start healing now. Let's pop the critical t heal real quick. So I can do some more crit heals. Shadows level 5 damage. Nice! Okay, cool. That's really good. I think somebody just popped that on me. That's good. Thank you for that. I appreciate it. Let's go pop that. <laughs> I have no idea who. We go stick on the Void's uh, soul counter and it should be just fine. Let's probably start here on Andre. Sorry about that. My bad. There we go. That can finally be sort of useful. There we go. Go ahead and chill back with spamming the cure for a little bit. I just mainly the heal for the group because that's the one I'm best at MMOs. Gotcha. Well, I mean, like, if you want to heal, go for it. I would just play my Thamator. Jack needs to play that.
There we go. And we got a treasure coffin, not bad. And yet another level up. <laughs> what? How am I able to level up so f Holy crap, this is ridiculous. How am I able to level up so fast? It has to be the food. It just gotta be the food. Oh my god. It's the food and the little necklace. This is insane. This is so freaking fast. That's a really fast level up. It's probably the circle that I have. That's probably what it is. This circle over here is just leveling me up like crazy. Old levels. I'm already like level 18. I'm already catching up to Andre and Something Bird easily. Actually, me and Something Bird are pretty much the same level now. Yeah, we're the same level, I think. I think I'm the only one with the, uh, the circle, though. Uh, Something Bird should have gotten a circle, I think, by any chance. Maybe. Hope he didn't sell it back, sadly. <laughs> Sorry, four numbers is a habit. What is? We going or what? Did I get a hat thing. Uh, it's a refer a friend bonus thing. There we go. It's a refer a friend bonus thing kind of thing. Like I somebody refer I did a refer a friend. Somebody uh I referred somebody, and then both of us got it. Yeah. Cooping yourself? Okay, that's fine. Hey, Doc Pie, welcome to the stream. Haven't seen in a while. How you doing today? How you doing? Hey, look at that. Now, but it's finally spamming stuff. Finally. Took it a while. Took it about a year and a half. <laughs> hey, Doc. Welcome to the stream, buddy. Welcome, welcome. Bust on Final Fantasy 14 tonight. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> the reason I have glasses on is because my contacts were eating the hell out of me earlier. Not literally, but. It just like felt really, really bad in the eyes. Oh, we probably should heal some. Uh, probably heal Andre right now. I have the flu and it sucks. I'm sorry, Doc Pie. I'm really sorry about that, bud. Uh, getting sick is just sucks. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry you're dealing with that. Let's go and do this here. I should be able to go through this area over here. I feel like after this dungeon I might just wrap up because I'm actually getting a little bit fatigued here. My eyes are slowly starting to kind of close themselves. I might actually go to bed earlier. Hopefully I'm not getting sick myself because that'd be terrible. <laughs> uh, Thor, what are we on? Damn you mean? I think they meant, I think they meant me. Because I don't think that we have a Thor. Oh no! Oh, Thor isn't like Andre. Okay, guys, I'm out for bed. Alright, see you, uh, Fia. Thanks so much for being here, buddy. Hope you enjoyed. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow, possibly. Uh, come over here for uh, tomorrow for Cry of Fear. I'm still going to be playing that. I'm looking forward to playing that. Anyway, thanks, man, for being here. We'll appreciate it. Exodus and me and them. Yep. We're all on Exodus. Thor happens to be me, fam. I know. I didn't realize, I didn't realize that at first. Sorry, I, did, I know he's Andre. I don't know he's Thor in there. But it's a Thor I didn't like think about, oh, maybe it's Andre's character, and like, oh, uh, I don't know, it just... <laughs> uh, though you could answer, I don't remember the name of the server. Yeah, I probably could. Famfrit here? Okay, cool, nice. Oh god, oh. I changed for you guys? <laughs> yes, you did. Yes, you certainly did. The Exodus server. Primary Cluster Exodus server. There we go. And Lance is taking some damage there. That's not good. Let's go and heal him up real quick. There we go. Oh god, heal up. Heal up real quick. Heal up. Come on, come on. Oh god. <laughs> Makes me feel really nervous when you have your health to have health. I'm popular apparently. People are switching servers for me. <laughs> I'm real popular. People want to switch out to servers just for me. <laughs> Am I reaching that point yet where people want to like come over and play with me? <laughs> nah, I really appreciate that you guys switched over the servers. It's really cool to be able to do this kind of stuff with you. And we'll definitely be able to level more in the future. I'm totally down for that. And eventually if we get you know, if we eventually over time just gather more people on the server. 
and we have a giant group and it's like eight people or so we'll probably end up running probably raids and stuff that'd be pretty cool maybe form a free company work for that really hard that'd be pretty sweet actually I wouldn't mind that I wouldn't mind that one bit there we go There we go, let's go ahead and put cast it on him. And attack you from the side. Oh god, and uh something bird is taking some damage. Okay. I got you, bud, don't worry. Ta-da! I heal your soul and everything else. Let's see, uh that was my fault. I thought you had pulled them, so I just started to shoot. Give me a break here. <laughs> yeah, it's all good. I can. I, it's. It's all be fine. I'm just go ahead and dance around here for a bit. Just frolic like a cowgirl. Why not? My TP is way under optimal. <laughs> Sounds good. Nah, it's all good. We can take time. While we take time, I'm gonna go ahead and grab the chest. Cause why not? Oh, look at this. What do we got here? Strength, vitality, skill, speed, dexterity, and critical rate. Oh, that's gonna be something nice for somebody. Go ahead and roll for that, guys. Have fun with that. Oh god, small X spike. This is like a pretty serious X spike. <laughs> I had a pretty serious X spike there one for a sec. My bad. My bad on that one. Let's go ahead and do this here. And attack from the side. No, no, my, they're already dead. <laughs> they're already dead. It's no point in me being here anymore. Let's see, what do we got here? We got a sweet looking hat, a ethereal hu uh, hunting hat. Not bad. We'll grab this right here. It's gonna send that like heal real quick. We we'll probably can go on offensive for a little bit. Hey Sam, I got 90 KED. Hey, it's again. What's up, buddy? Welcome to Steam. Welcome, welcome. What do you mean you got 90 KED? What do you mean by that? How are you doing today, by the way? Hope you're having a good day. Kago says meow. Yes, dog. Yes, dog. But Kago does certainly say meow. <laughs> I mean, I hope Kagro says meow. I'll always be a little weird if they, if they did meow. <laughs> Whether this is Tanya. Oh, hello, Tanya. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Nice to see you here. How are you doing today? Wait, are you Tanya from the free company? Let me just check on that. It's not letting me check my free company. I, I think it might be Tanya from, from the free company. Sorry, I I am not 100% sure. Or like, I haven't got to meet a lot of people in free company just yet. I know we did like a, a free company merger and like two free companies combined together into one. Uh, so I'm still getting to know some people. So <laughs> nice to meet you though. I saw you in FC chat. Oh, nice. Yeah. But yeah, I'm still going to be getting used to just like meeting new people in the free company and all that. So for a while, I'm not going to know anybody whatsoever. And the Lancer pulled. Or the, yeah, Lancer he pulled. Damn it. <laughs> God damn it. That's not gonna be good. Just take it, buddy. You got it. Just keep at it. <laughs> you can do it. Sort of. Nope, he's a lost cause. Never mind. <laughs> as bad as it sounds, he might be a lost cause. Let's go and heal up Sunfall Bird a bit. Actually, the uh, Lancer is not doing too bad. Lancer is actually doing pretty well. Disconnected. It says error 9000. Yeah, oh wow. That kind of sucks. I'm sorry about that. I don't know what's going on there. Maybe it's something that has to do with the servers? I don't know. The patch 3.2 is coming around the corner, so maybe something's going on. Headless Cacro says nothing. That's that's kind of sounds really morbid, Doc Pie. I read nothing about headless cacros. Let's keep let's let's uh let's let's keep heads on them. That'd be lovely. <laughs> that's, that'd be just lovely. You joined dead. <laughs> Sorry about that. Usually more friendly than this. Let's go in here and chat. Welcome, welcome. Dungeon, but welcome. Oh. There we go. Let's go through here. We gotta get the cultist rosary in order to open up the thing. So let's go ahead and do that. There we go. And I think I probably attacked the one the. Uh, Mages. I'm gonna go ahead and just put up down on them. I know mine. I'm gonna actually heal Andre. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh Jesus Christ, spam like crazy. Oh shit. 
I was not ready. My butt was not ready for this. My butt cheeks will not clench for this. Oh, god damn it. That sucks. My bad, my bad. My bad. Oh, my bad. Run! <laughs> freaking run! Just freaking spin for it. And now I'm dead. <laughs> damn it. Damn it. I'm Shao Koroth Berry. Yeah, that's actually Sufferbird. He is actually kind of running with, him, with us. Sufferbird is the archer. And then Andre, who is also in chat, is the tank. They got disconnected. Damn it, Nordic Goblins. <laughs> It's so good, Tanya. We understand. Does you know this you know the goblins just you know they just want the internet. That's all they want. <laughs> remember that Skyrim episode? Ah, uh, yeah, I remember that. That was pretty morbid, and I actually was terrifying. <laughs> Which head do you want to still be attached to them? Ah, uh, what do you mean for me or for the cowgirl? Ah, uh, cowgirls have just one head, so maybe just the you know the head. <laughs> I don't know. It's kind of an odd question to ask, to be honest. Alright, well, let me see if I can sprint back and try to rescue the entire party here. Or well, hopefully try to rescue the entire party. Guys, stay alive, please. Stay alive. Just, just sing the song, you'll be fine. You know, just sing the Stay Alive song, you'll be alright. Stay alive, stay alive. Oh, 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 oh. Need some water. <laughs> there we go. No, it looks like they actually... Are they still alive there? I think they might be alive there. Oh, need me to press the uh, lock button. I think they might be alive. You guys good? You guys are yeah, you guys are right. That's actually not bad. <laughs> we did it! We did a Reddit, but somehow did it. Even though Reddit had nothing to do with it. I think we somehow won. I believe. I'm not sure exactly what happened. Lancer's uh gearing up on something else. Let's actually check on the ads, see what they're like. Did we grab the uh the thing, the rosary? I hate my internet. May as well call it dial up. <laughs> Damn. Did we get it? No, there's two guys around there, never mind. Did we kill any of them? Maybe just one. Damn it. <laughs> That's not good. I guess we'll just wait here. Let me go ahead. Oh yeah, let me go ahead and now cast the protect here. Victor is protected. There we go. Okay, now I'll be good. I can promise you that. I can promise you that I will cast healing spells like no like no tomorrow. Just to make sure that you are kept on the lifeline support. If I take some damage from the mages like I'm doing right now, then that's gonna kinda suck, but whatever. I try my best here. <laughs> no, there's a Fudo Kagro family. You want the other. No! What What do you mean, Fudo Kagro? No. No Fudos, please. No Fudos. Good evening, Sam. Hey, Novaria. What's up, buddy? Welcome to Steam. Welcome, welcome. Play some low levels dungeons at the moment. Leveling with some people here from the stream. And uh, just figure out how to play healer for the first time in ever. <laughs> Get my. You know, just dipping my kind of feet into the healing waters, see what they'll like. Just test now to see what healing, you know, is going to become like at a certain point in the future. Because I mostly just want to kind of go for Astrologian. And I'm just kind of leveling Contra because it's going to be like a dual, uh, like a dual job. Not dual job. God, what, what, what is it called again? I forgot what they're called again. It's like the, uh, there's a primary job, then a secondary job, then there's a tertiary job. It's going to be like a secondary job or something. I think Torture Job is Arcanist? I think? Maybe Black Mage, I have no idea. I I, I don't play much of a healer whatsoever. <laughs> this is my first real healer experience. It's not the best either, because I'm not good. <laughs> when I said my butt was not ready for this, it sounded like he was talking about smacks. No, my butt was just not ready for this. My butt was not clenched, and I was not ready because I was just getting attacked from all over the place. He's just a saying. <laughs> Careful the dog, don't want him to be like that. The dog to be, would be like, nah. The dog could just join, dude. Chill. <laughs> really, I gotta learn how to play Tanker because I'm enjoying Marauder. Nice. I'll keep you all full. <laughs> well, if you can heal, uh, son, go for it. But I think it might be my job at this point to just kind of like pump, uh, just heal, heal spells after heal spells. Okay, God, this is actually gonna be scary. Uh, I'm scared. I'm pretty scared. You get a hit as well. I'm, I'm taking all the ads. I'm taking all the ads here. Oh god. I'm screwed. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm done. I'm done. That's it. That's how. That's how. That's how. That's my swan song. This is a little my swan song. I'm about to sing it. <laughs> I end up just grabbing all the ads. Was well, as, as long as the gra ads are grabbed, I'm fine. It's whatever. Go and do this. Come on, come on, come on. Jesus Christ, this is gonna be terrible. I'll keep you MP and TV for one on board. Okay, good. That'd be awesome. That'd be fantastic. Because I'm going to be running out of it 
pretty fast, I think. Oh, well, I saved that, sort of. I think. Can't exactly call it save if I didn't want to save it much. Can I use the cultist robes? Or orbs? No, I can use this one whatsoever. Let's go and do this here. Then, what would you say if you want it on a pole more than once? Ah. Uh, if you want it on a pole more than once? I would prefer if you guys didn't, but there's nothing really stopping you from doing that. If, if anything, what I would do is actually, like, if you want to, like, repost it to your friends or something, or watch the stream as well, and have them actually interact in the poll, then go for it, you can. But I prefer if you, uh, didn't, uh, preferably vote twice something. Just kill ads from YouTube, go fam. I'm not really killing ads from YouTube, I'm just killing ads from the game. I was, I was gonna get a cup. I was gonna grab water, but otherwise I probably should target and heal. There you go. I hear from uh, a lot of players I play on, like with a controller, that apparently it's a lot easier to heal with a controller instead of a keyboard and mouse. Let's see, and we got now a shield, strength, vitality, parry, and accuracy. Not bad. I'm gonna go ahead and inch my way towards the entrance of the boss. We go, hey Faith, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Just vote once, War. Make it fair. Yeah, it's just vote once. And I got the shield. Lovely. Greatest healing shield ever. Strength? Man, that's what healers need nowadays. <laughs> okay, stepping in. Alright, let's do this, and hopefully we will not die. No guarantees, though, because I don't really know what I would do much. I'm going to health drops a little bit more before I heal it. Kind of pre-anticipate a little bit about like how much damage you've been taking there. There we go. There we go. Good, good, good. Uh, okay, you guys are attacking the imp. Good, awesome. Let's go and re debuff the enemy or put another dot on him. Vampire noticed me. Faith, you have been noticed. I do notice you. Welcome to the stream. I uh, hope you're having a good day and uh, hi. How's it going? What's up? <laughs> and more ads show up. Okay, great. Uh, let's go and put up the dot on this guy. And help out uh, Andre. Oh god. Andre. This is gonna be clutch, buddy. This is gonna be clutch. I'm gonna try my best here. I'm gonna try my best. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're totally solid. We're good, guys. Hopefully, somehow made it. Somehow, we end up making it. We got one more wave to go from, and that's going to be kind of something as well. Oh, back away a little bit. There we go. Good, good, good. Doing good. Let's go both from Duck Me. Oh, I'm sorry, Faith. I'm real sorry about that. Uh, how are you holding up from that? Also, how do you, Like, I don't know. I. Th I think it's gonna be kind of bad to ask about how bad, like how bad was it? Like, were you guys like long dating or is like I don't know. I guess I, I guess I probably shouldn't pry. I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry that you that uh you got dumped. It will suck, especially with Vantas they come around. Holy shit! Ouch! Hope you like slap him or something. <laughs> God damn! That's actually pretty. That's pretty savage. I'm sorry though. You good? Well, as long as you're good. As long as you're good. Um. Regarding Valentine's Day though, I'm not sure if you heard, but I'm going to be doing a Valentine's Day stream and I'm currently doing a straw poll on games to play for the stream, so some, somehow at a certain point, yeah, now about actually linked just recently the straw poll, I think you'll probably find it through some of the commands there and uh, vote on some of the games we can be playing on Valentine's Day, because I'm not doing anything, so we're going to be having a singles awareness day and playing either How to Fool Boyfriend, a picture dating sim, which is hilarious and ridiculous, a Akiba strip will be strip people in Japan, or and somebody uses limber break. Not bad. Nice. It actually looks really freaking cool. Or we'll be playing some Yandere Simulator, which is just a classic at this point. <laughs> at this point, by our standards, it's a solid classic. There we go. So feel free to vote on the thing. Tuesday barf Wednesday. What the hell, Doc? What is that coming from? If you're sick, I'm sorry, bud. Oh my god, yeah. 
But yeah, you should be able to see the... Uh, let me go ahead and relink the, uh, the straw poll real quick. Go ahead and copy that. Copy link address. Let me relink it. I'm going to post it in chat. You should be able to see it there. Uh, scrolling up a little bit. And uh, yeah, feel free to vote on any of the games there. And uh, yeah, that will kind of help me figure out which game we'll be playing on Sunday. So far, it's kind of a tie. Last time I checked, it was like 7, uh, seven uh, for Akiba Strip, 7 for How to Fall Boyfriend, and then like 1 or 2 for Yandere Simulator. If we end up having a tie, I might play both games, but the thing is, I was thinking maybe allocate a lot of time for just one game, so we can really all kind of enjoy the ridiculous nature of it and stuff. That's the only thing we could do. But yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I have to think about it for a little bit. It is currently... Okay, been streaming for about two hours. I got my gear now. Nice. I'll probably actually call it here for the night because I'm feeling just fatigued. Morning classes really wear me out. Yeah, I'm still top donor. Yes, you are a <laughs> But apparently Barclay is threatening me with another nation, so he might be challenging me that a little bit. <laughs> I guess we'll just have to wait and see. But yeah, right now you're still uh, uh, set up as a top donor. I'll eventually when I get a new PC and stuff, I'll play around with more maybe graphics uh, for OBS and streams and maybe see if I can do like a nice little layout or something. <laughs> So I think Tiny wants in. I guess we could... Yeah, we can have Tiny go in. Do any more dungeons? Need DPS? Yeah, we could get DPS. Yeah. We can make this team config an official team duo. Sure, yeah. Let's go ahead and do for another run then. I can do another run. But then I gotta get some rest. Okay, so we got ourselves a DPS, a tank, a healer, and another DPS. We are set and ready to do another dungeon here. Let's see, uh, as long as we make sure we're good. Next dungeon we gotta do is actually a copper of a mine dungeon. I think we're pretty much the same level with everything. I'll load my lancer to green two, then use this as my main. Alright, sounds good. Yeah, I'll be fine. I just got here again, what the fuck? No, Faith, we'll do one more dungeon. Don't worry, we'll do one more dungeon. We'll stay out for a little bit more. <laughs> Sorry about that. But uh, I'll see if I can stream for longer on Sunday because, I mean, we're going to play some ridiculous ass games anyway, so she be pretty fun. Uh. Actually, let me check the results for the straw poll on my phone here. Let's see what they are at at the moment. Just want to see if we, like, if we have some sort of like a, a tiebreaker or something. <laughs> We go ahead and I guess queue us in for Copper Bomb Mines then. There we go. I can do it all done up to Cutter's Cry. Which one is that? Cutter's Cry is... Is up in the second thing? Maybe I don't have Cutter's Cry at the moment. Yeah, I probably don't have Cutter's Cry at the moment. Whatever, I'm gonna go ahead and actually roll this right now. Join for the dungeon. There we go. And we got Insta queue right in here. Loot rule normal. I'm totally down for that. Can we check here on notification? Check the straw poll. And see how the Storpal is doing for us. <laughs> Let's see, results. Nope. The ad results. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We're starting dungeon here. Uh, looks like Akiba Strip is actually winning. Nine votes uh, to Harafo Boyfriend, seven votes. Okay, looks like we got some sort of a tiebreaker going on, but it's still not over yet. Matt to bed, still kind of the best. Alright, Faith, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm really sorry about that. Uh, if there's anything we can do to cheer you up, just let us know. And I'll try to do some. I'll try to do my best. Uh, sorry you got broken up with, but hey, if you got free time on Valentine's Day and just want to, you know, hang out with a bunch of singles, just nerd out over some games, just have some ridiculous, ridiculous stupid fun, then come over to Sunday and uh, maybe that will, you know, make me feel better as we play something ridiculous. <laughs> I want to make sure that everybody has a good time on a Sunday because I mean I got nothing going on so <laughs> We'll probably we'll probably have you know some sort of blast just play some ridiculous games there <laughs> But that's stripping being it's literally stripping people that's it yes That's the thing though that's the comp the combat is we build up combinations and then whenever the enemies are weak enough We take the pants off we take the clothes off we take the shoes we take the hats we take everything we take all the clothes off Make sure that they become naked. We make the world naked. <laughs> and we run around Akiba, which is kind of cool. It is pretty neat. How free Sunday sounds good. Hey, look, we'll be two bards. Yes, you'll be two bards. We have one bard and we'll have another bard. Bard's army for the win. <laughs> and there we go. Go and do this. And do this. 
and heal up Andrew real quick. Gotta heal up a little bit more. Can I unlock any other spells? No, I can't really. Uh, next spell I gotta unlock is at level 22, just stone 2, never mind. So stone would just do some damage here. There we go, we're going to go to the left, everybody. All aboard! Okay, go for it. Oh, look at that, we actually got, uh, My Coats and Aura. <laughs> My Coats and Aura are like the most popular races for Final Fantasy XIV, I think. Even, like, I think they're even more popular than the Lala Fells. Lala Fells are pretty popular, but it's freaking My Coats and Aura. You know, Tham made the bard, yeah. Bard for the win! I freaking love Bard. It's an amazing class. I love being able to like uh, use songs and everything. It's amazing. What's my Bard's eye level? Oh god. And my our Bard's eye level is 196. There we go. It's not it's not really high. I got a nice weapon though, to an uh, item level 200 weapon, which is nice. Uh, it's not like an animal weapon or anything, but it's not bad. It's nice. It's cool. I like it. I was actually very lucky with getting Gyo from the new raid and everything. So pretty much got a full set, 35. <laughs> gotcha. Let's go through here. We got a couple more enemies to fight. Actually, we got like four or five bosses here. Fight. And one of the bosses is really interesting. This slime one. Oh, that's actually gonna be really fun to fight. Looking forward to that. There we go. Right after this, we think. No, we don't get to the next boss until a while. Until like the this area of this next zone. It's been a long, long as dungeons. Dungeons in Final Fantasy XIV in general are a little cumbersome because they're long. Um. But they're really fun at the same time because, like, I don't know, it's, it has a, everything to offer you, plus the amount of experience you can gain from these things is ridiculous. Like, I'm actually about to level up right here, right now, after we get this skill. So, guys, let's go ahead and hurry up and get this skill and get me a little to level 20. And watch this. Da, 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 da. That was way off pitch, my bad. God, my throat is really, really taking a toll here. Ah. <sighs> Whew, all right then. Level 50, good gear. Oh yeah, definitely. Let's go through this. Oh, there's a treasure chest. You guys go ahead and uh, yeah, I'm pop a heal, right? You go ahead and uh, survive through this. I'm gonna go ahead and pop a heal. Run over to the treasure coffer, and then I will grab whatever is inside. Let's see what we got here. We got potions. Nice. That was actually absolutely useless. I was hoping gear, but no, we got potions. Oh yeah, this is uh, the mine, so we don't actually get a lot of gear from here. We just get a bunch of potions, that's all it is. At least from my experience. You play most of Sergeant Thomas? Gotcha. Well, uh, Tanya, you should fully consider going all the way to... Uh, <laughs> going all the way to our server, because I think we are actually pretty awesome here. <laughs> and fully uh, like made a character on Exodus. Well, if you want to, it's up to you though. <laughs> <laughs> no pressure or anything, no pressure. <laughs> I love to win 9 here, nice. That's pretty sweet, actually. I was thinking to eventually make a character on one of the European servers. Granted, they made the new European cluster, and a lot of people are moving over there, so that would be pretty fun to do. Let me see if I can find, like, a, a little, not really hardcore raiding scene, but another kind of, like, raiding scene there, possibly, because I hear people in Europe. They freaking love to raid in the game. Yeah, convert. <laughs> you should totally consider that. I mean, I know we're joking. About, I know we like to joke here, but you should definitely consider it. That's for sure. Kind of blood thing. Gotcha. Let's go pop a air thing on this guy. There we go. And let's go ahead and hit a couple rocks here. Put a couple rocks in the face should do the trick. There we go. Okay, let's go over to the ads. We do them, but sadly I came here. 
I mean, what do you mean sad? Wait, 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 wait. What do you mean sadly? Also, Luna Moon, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Hope you enjoying the stream. And uh, how you doing today? <laughs> but hey, uh, son, what do you mean? Uh, we you sadly came here. Do <laughs> Don't, don't stop telling me you regret coming here. <laughs> Otherwise, you're gonna make me feel bad. <laughs> Please don't. I don't want to. I don't want to feel bad. Like I don't want to feel like as if like I forced you here. That'd be terrible. That'd be absolutely awful. There we go. Let's go over here. Where do we go? I guess we. I'm gonna go ahead and fight Andre there. That's what I'm gonna do. There we go. Hit him with rocks a couple times, and we should be a okay. But with PVE cues, I like not existing there. Oh, gotcha. I mean, PVE cues I hear not bad either. Like just like five minutes most of the time for DPS and stuff. I mean, for low levels, yeah, sure, it's it's gonna be something. But for like max level and stuff like that, it's not bad whatsoever. Like level 60, no problem. Hell, even before Heaven's Ward, it was still not bad whatsoever. Like, I could get into, like, not the menu raids, but, like, I guess, A player, uh, Guild Hess, in a way. I guess that would be called, considered sort of Guild Hess, see? Sort of? I don't know, Trials, I guess. Uh, or Duties. I would be able to get into, like, A player Duties, no problem. And would wouldn't take me long whatsoever. I mean, even now, when I get in Dungeons as my level level character, it takes maybe, like, 5 to 10 minutes, but it's not too bad. It's a coffee back there? Oh, I wish probably go get it. That'd be pretty good. There we go. And somebody already tagged in me. Let's go ahead and might as well fight him. Might as well. <laughs> One arc, void arc under five minutes all the time. Yes, yeah, void arc is under five minutes for me as well. I think because everybody is like, everybody on the mother is trying to do it. <laughs> I guess we're not going for the coffee then. Or maybe we are. Are we? I guess we probably should go back to the coffer real quick. Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and lead. I'm gonna lead all the way to the coffer. That's what I'm gonna do. And everybody this is gonna follow. <laughs> That's what's gonna happen. I could try to go around this guy and try to nick it real quick. Are we fighting there? Yeah, somebody's fighting over there. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and run by it. Oh god. Bad idea. Here, here's what I'm gonna do. Here's what I'm gonna do. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Nick it and a run. Nick and run. Nick and run. Nick and run. There we go. Just run. So for just run for it. Let's get out of here. Let's go! Run! Run, guys! God damn it! I'm gonna have to start healing everybody here. Okay, good. Let's tag this guy real quick. Just hit him with everything we got. We really want to get the coffer. That was my bad. I didn't see me with that. That was not on Sun. That was on me. That was all on me. There we go. Let me go ahead and heal everybody up. Make sure we're all good. Okay. We somehow survived that. Somehow. Usually that ends up being pretty bad. Usually. Right, I'm waiting. I'm waiting. It's all good. It's all good. Yeah, just go ahead and take your time with it. I'm in no rush. I'm just a healer. I'm gonna let you do all the pullings and stuff. I'm just gonna chill back here as much as I can, and try not to uh, attract ads. That's what I'm. That's a little much up. Here's a healer. Also, do I? Okay, no mind. I already got my raisins and everything going. Uh, let's see. Alt F2. Yeah, there we go. That's what I can do. I'm going to heal up Andre real quick. There we go. So do I get any uh, new traits anytime soon? I think I love, yeah, at level 24 again. Increase mine, which is really good. I would like that a lot, actually. There we go. I'm going to back here for a bit. Take your time, Andre. Take seriously. Take your time. You're the tank, and uh, I'm the healer, and everybody else is DPS. So uh, it's kind of like your call on when we pull things. <laughs> Let's go ahead and grab this over here. Or we'll go ahead and heal up. Throw some fire sands. I'll take some fire sands. There we go. Nice, very nice. Let's go ahead and heal up the sun real quick. Get your butt. For some reason I can't walk backwards whenever I am pressing that alt. I think it's because that activates Whisper. Yeah, that's what it does. 
Just activates Whisper and Child Guard. So I'm not gonna worry about it for now. So we should have some more Fire Sands around here, I would think. Guess not. Gonna chill over here and do some DPSing for a little bit. There we go. Alright, we gotta collect a couple more Fire Sands. And I got Soulbound or something. Not sure what. There's a Fire Sand up there. And by the time I got it. That's good. Let's go ahead and load up the Powdered Chamber. And then, uh... We'll just activate the uh, Blast Device. Let's go ahead and blow through this thing. I love how they implemented the ability to, like... Progress further by, like, interacting with the objects. Like, exploding stuff like that. I like that. I like that a lot. It makes me feel more like part of this universe than anything else. Alright, let's go ahead and do this boss fight real quick. This bunch of Spriggan are going to be falling all over the place, and uh, we try to get all of them as fast as possible. <laughs> That's literally it. That's the job for today. I'm going to be spawning from all over the place. Just sneak as many of them as you can. I got this one over here. Didn't hit him on much, but it was something. This smacked him with something. And a lot more starts showing up. We get this guy over here. Awesome. Quick AOE heal. I think now we got a bomb coming in from up here. Usually there is one bomb or somewhere around here. Yeah, there's a, a flame bow coming in. A flambo. Let's go get this guy. Oh, this is the same guy from Final Fantasy 3. I remember this. I remember this guy. Wow, that's actually kind of kind of neat, actually. I'm finally seeing creatures coming in from like uh, all the Final Fantasy universes finally appearing together. Finally. I mean, I saw them in 13. Just never. I don't. I when I play A, I was like, they look a little bit familiar. I think I saw them before, and only just now realized. Wait a minute, it's the same thing, same kind of creatures. It's actually pretty cool. I don't know, some of you may not seem like like a big deal, it's like, yeah, they are some creatures, but to me, as somebody who never really got into, like, you know, I never really got to experience Final Fantasy Universe from the start, it's like, oh, it's actually kind of exciting. I don't know. I'm just nerding out over it for no reason. And now we got the big boss coming in over here. Let's go and get him real quick. There we go. And I'm gonna go run from him. Because he's gonna wanna fight people. Oh god, that's not good. Ow, that kind of hurt. There we go. I'm heading to bed. See you guys. Uh, hold on one sec. Uh, I'm heading to bed now, guys. See you. Oh, cry if you're tomorrow. All right. See you, regard. Thanks so much for being here, buddy. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Uh, sorry, I'm just mostly just doing dungeons here. I'm kind of rambling about dungeons or whatever other obscure things I can think of. But I'll see you tomorrow when I play Cry if you're, buddy. Hope you enjoy that and have a good night. Did I level up? No, not yet. <laughs> I'm so used to just like leveling up real fast at this point. So what have we got here? Metality intelligence. Ooh, I'll take all this. It's gonna be all kind of good healer stuff. All kinds of good healer stuff. I'll gladly grab it. Do -do -do. Love it. Thank you. Appreciate that. Get this Aaron Souls real quick. I think there's a chest. Yeah, there's a treasure coffer back here. I can quickly nab that. We go get some Vaza Better. Or somebody got some Vaza Better. And we can get these Aaron Souls real quick. And probably also heal up Andre. Ooh. Sorry about that, Andre. <laughs> My bad. Maybe I should play as a scholar and just have the fairy, like, face roll heal for me. <laughs> Maybe I might just have to do that. Let's go over here. I'll take the elevator, I think, down. I think we're going even lower. There we go. All right, now we go down. And right behind us, sweet. All right, now another blasting powder through here, and eventually we'll get to the slime boss, which is actually kind of cool. I think it's in the grind dark area, and now finally the gold throne, the final boss. Looks pretty awesome. <laughs> then I'm playing loot box simulator. <laughs> you know it. I love it. 
I don't know, it's just really fun to kind of find these kind of chests around, and whenever they're just around and I'm like playing as any class, even as a tank sometimes, I'll be like, alright guys, give me a moment, I'm gonna go ahead and loot the chest, just wait for me a little bit. <laughs> just give me a, like one second, literally one second. I wanna be able to just grab my loot real quick. We need, we're gonna need a little bit more than that amount of uh, fire salts at the moment. I think we need a couple more from these enemies that we gotta kill. From the blasting caps. Let's go and grab them here. And also get the errant soul. Oh. For some reason, it constantly activates uh, chat for me. I don't know why. Let's go ahead and help Andre. There we go. Andre, stay alive a little bit. Actually, we are back. You guys are uh, going to stay alive for a little bit more. We'll grab the treasure chest. <laughs> there we go. And we got ourselves a pair of earrings, which I already have, so I'm not gonna grab them. Actually, are they any good? Come on, the same thing. There's no reason for me to grab them at the moment. I'm gonna beat them. Able to obtain, you already possess. I guess I'll just pass it then. Need a little bit more. <laughs> more Tham loot. Well, yeah, why would I not want to run around and grab some loot? Sounds amazing to me. <laughs> it's just lying there. I'm just gonna swing by and get it real quick. And everybody still stays alive. That's all that matters. I already got the loot, Andre. <laughs> That's what I kind of do. Whenever I play as like a class, I can like swing away for a little bit, grab the loot, and come back. That's just what I like to play. <laughs> That's what ends up happening for me. I, what can I say? I just like to nab loot. <laughs> <laughs> I just really enjoy nabbing loot there. You guys put a thing on the blasting cap, run over here, check for any more loot just in case. No, I think we're good. I could probably just continue main healing for a bit. There we go. And we got more fire salts. I'm gonna continue healing though. I think I'm gonna really enjoy healing in this game, especially when it comes to playing Astrologian because of the whole card RNG mechanic that they got. Yes, it's gonna be very unpredictable, but that's the thing what's gonna be most exciting about it. Be able to like just draw a card, any card, and just you kind of have to figure out a way to implement it in the best possible way to help out the raid or the uh, the dungeon party, whatever. Got more six uh, ounce pinch of fire salt. With those stream, yeah, sounds good. I don't know why, but on YouTube gaming. Uh, it ends up, well, the stream didn't die, technically. What ends, <laughs> ends up happening with YouTube Gaming, I don't know, it's happened yesterday as well with me, uh, when I was watching somebody else, like I said earlier. It just would not, I don't know, it was giving it static for some reason, it just get a bunch of errors. I'm not sure exactly why, but it's whatever at this point. Let's grab the fire stands real quick. There we go. Alright, now this boss, I'm not sure if you guys ever did him, this boss is actually kind of something. So, uh, Sunfinbird and Andre, if you guys are listening up, uh, you got a DPS, like, uh, the DPS have to DPS any ads that come up. The tank has to tank the boss, and whenever the ad from the improved blasting device comes out, you gotta kill him a little bit, and then, uh, make it explode near the Icarus Ire, and kind of explode him over and over and over. That's about it. There we go. I'm gonna go ahead and pull you over here to you. You gotta make sure that the ad gets uh, exploded in the explosion from the uh, from the blasting cap, like that. Keep him in there, like that. Good. Now it was into two. Now it's two slimes. Go and pop another heal here just in case, and use the pro uh, improved blasting device. Make sure to get him over here to the tank. Wait, oh, Tiny is on top of this. I like that. I'll, I'm liking Tiny. She is on top of it. So, oh, Tanya, <laughs> Tiny, if you're still listening, thank you, thank you for being on top of all things. There we go. Now we just take care of the little ads, little adlings. Well, we gotta split them up a little bit more before we do anything else with them. And Son is just jumping around. <laughs> we 
We got one more blasting cap. Let's go and put a dot in it. Continue healing all the way through and through. That was gonna go well. This is actually a really awesome run. The first time I did this dungeon ever, we ended up just kind of chilling there for like 20 minutes, not knowing what to do. Then we just reset. Just, you know, we end up dying, reset the thing. And now we can actually kill all these guys. So go ahead and AoE like crazy. Make it a lot easier. If I had the, uh, the Thamator just AoE ability, I probably would spamming it right now. Well, anyway, let's get up Fire Sands and grab the chest and whatnot. There we go. We got actually two sets of loot here. We got a sword, not bad, and a shield. Another tank and shield, not bad. I can probably actually pass that instead. Let's go and blow this place up. There we should be a okay. Coming all, all the way to the almost, actually, the very last boss at this point. Just gotta go to the cold throne, that's it. We'll probably avoid most of the ads here, to be honest, and kind of like go around them. If you guys want to, unless you want to fight them, then go for it. <laughs> if you don't want to fight them, that's up to you. Also, let me just make sure that I get boss for everybody. There we go. Now time to heal like crazy. Go back away a little bit. Just a tiny bit. Put up the dot on the enemy. Toss some rocks into his face. Lovely. <laughs> what a lovely healer we are. Just freaking tossing rocks into people's faces. It's like, hi right, guys, I can support you. <laughs> I threw a rock. I, I can do this, guys. I can DPS support. <laughs> I don't know. To me, it's like I'm just imagining a conjurer just picking up a boulder next to uh, next like next to them and just throwing it at the enemy. It's like, oh, what the hell? Stop! I'm I'm like fighting the tank here. Quit throwing freaking rocks at me. I don't know. In my mind, what I'm imagining, this scenario is a lot more hilarious than what it sounds like right now, that I'm explaining it. I'm just gonna put up a dot on this guy, just make sure we wear him down a little bit. I need to make sure I practice doing some sort of damage as a healer, because I know eventually down the line, healers gotta do some damage out there, even just a little bit. In order to kind of like, I don't know, pull the weight a little bit. Can I use the level 2 LB on the last boss? Not use archers before. Uh, sure, go for it. Sure, sure, fine by me. I actually don't have limit break on here at all, do I? We should go ahead and put it up somewhere here. Let's go ahead and use the, move the res like this. Now, where's that chest hat that we're looking for? Is it over here? Is it behind us? Chest left. I guess we could, pro could probably go for the chest. It'll be pots? Yeah, it probably will be. This place has a lot of potions as it is. And another set of ads coming in. Oh god, he just came out of freaking nowhere. Go ahead and run back real quick. Uh, I'm just gonna stay back here. In a safe distance. Oh, this is not a safe distance. This is very much not a safe distance. He is pounding my face in. Ow. 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 It's gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt a lot. Oof. It's gonna be not good. You heal your crazy? Oh god. Andre, I'm gonna heal your crazy, buddy. I got you, I'm trying my best, I'm trying my best. Stay, hang in there, hang in there, hang in there. You got it, you got it, you got it, hang in there. You can do it, you can do it, you can do it. I can believe in you. I believe in you, okay, good. Oh, Christ, subverted. That's good. <laughs> I don't know how the hell I did it, but somehow we did it. And I think I'm almost about to level, yeah, I'm about to level up here, actually, in a little bit. <laughs> Dallas Gilpatrick, welcome to the stream, buddy. Hope you're enjoying the video if you're watching the video. Hope you're enjoying the stream if you're watching the stream. Feel free to say hello in chat. What you just heard, guys, here was the double Final Fantasy Congratulations music playing because I got level up and somebody subscribed. So, <laughs> hello, Dallas. Welcome to the stream, buddy. Welcome, welcome. Or if you're watching the video, welcome to the video and overall channel. How you doing today? Also, feel free to say stuff, uh, like, feel free to say hello in chat. We're very welcome the crowd here. We don't bite. Thank you, thank you, appreciate it. Got all kinds of love ups going off for myself, and all my gears breaking, slowly but surely. There we go. See, next level ability is. God, what's gonna be at? It's gonna be Stoya oh yeah, Stone, I keep forgetting about that.
Let's see what we got here for levels. Stream down for me again. I'm s <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't know what it is, uh, Andre. It's something that has to do with YouTube gaming, I know that's for sure. It's something on no end. Because for me, I mean, I'm having actually a lot better connection than I used to have before. It's, it's actually all right, right, about, right about now. <laughs> it's not too bad. It's still pretty bad, but it usually can be a lot worse, so... But yeah, I, I don't know what it is. Like, uh, like, like I said, it's probably something that has to do with YouTube gaming. Folks, as when they arrive, yeah, that's pretty much it. Yep. So they're ready to watch. Yeah, that's pretty much the idea. Although most groups out there just kind of burn through the ads and don't even worry about it. And they kind of just deal with the boss and that's it. It's up to you, whatever you want to do. Let's see, what can I... I don't want to put in any new abilities for now because I know it's going to like reset my cooldown sometimes. So I'm not going to do it just yet, but I'd like to maybe spec into another ability there, like or here or there. I'll have to level up a little bit. So ignoring the boss might not be a good idea. Yeah, sounds good. Yeah, we probably should not ignore the boss. What do you think of do it? Ah, it's up to you. If only you... If only you are... Comfortable with it. There we go. If, you, if only you're comfortable with it. If you're not, then we're not gonna do that. I'm down with whatever. I'm gonna just end up healing like crazy. <laughs> One way or the other. One way or the other. Let's go run over here. Actually, I'm gonna take my time to actually do some damage here. Actually, it pops the burst for a bit. Then do some sort of damage. Help out a tiny little bit, tiny little smidge. Go and help out with this. We can try to burn through them as best as possible. Just don't know if we be really helping out much. Hey there, YouTubers. Is this the Black Reaper speaking to you from this user? So he gracefully allowed me to talk to you. What are you talking about, Rock Light? What do you mean? Black Reaper speaking to you from this user. What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright. Actually, I should probably help the uh, against the Stone Servant, shouldn't I? Uh, Andre, hang in there for a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take care of this real quick. There we go. Let's go and heal up here. Oh no, Andre, you're good. Never mind. You're good on health for now. I'm just spammy cure there. I pro I, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and follow what Afia said. Just not spam cure so much. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna try to do. Okay, let's go ahead and deal with this guy here real quick. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can burst again to try to get the guy down. I'm gonna probably see if we can take him out a little bit here. I'm gonna spam stone on him as much as possible. I'm here to tell you that me and my crew are soon to reap what was sown by the idiots that tried to go over the heads of us. What do you mean? What? Okay, Verklite. <laughs> All right, buddy. No, not, I'm I'm thoroughly lost yet. <laughs> what? Okay. Kind of reminds me of that one one Star Wars RP that people were doing. Uh, was it? I think it was Star Wars RP in uh, on the stream that one time, like a week ago, right? I don't remember actually what it was. It was some kind of RP that people were doing a week ago. Okay, whatever. Unless this is your clever way of like. Uh, preparing me for the donation or something. <laughs> Trying to give me a heart attack. I'm checking my phone just in case. <laughs> almost got the guy. Oh, we almost got him. Sweet. We're gonna help out here real quick. Actually, we could probably just go ahead and burst the guy. Yeah, just over to burst him. Limit break as soon as possible if you get to level 2 limit break. If you don't, just go ahead and limit break as soon as possible. Won't be able to get to level 2 at this point. Yeah, just limit break. Go ahead and limit break right now. Yeah, there you go. Oh, that's... I freaking love the archer limit break. It is awesome. You, like, grab a crossbow and fire it off. It's freaking great. I'll work with the red reaper and the blue reaper. Alright, cool. Is that, like, a Team Fortress reference? <laughs> Sorry, that's, like, the only thing I can think about when, like, red and blue. Unless it's, like, a red and blue pill. Then that I would understand. That's Matrix at that point. <laughs> that's the stuff I grew up on. Let's go ahead and take this. Am I running out of... I think I'm running out of arm. Yeah, I'm running out of helmet inventory. I'm gonna have to store away some of the helmets I don't need and sell some of the ones that I don't care for. 
You see, when you have a lot of classes, you end up running out of inventory space a lot when it comes to gear. And I don't think that's like two pages or three pages here whatsoever. Let's go and swing out here. You're gonna change the Mikot? Alright, sounds a good time, yeah? Well, welcome to the Mikot family. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it's actually pretty cool. Only do it if you want to do it. Only, only switch over to the Mikot if you want to switch to Mikot. I personally like Mikot, but I'm biased. I just like hack girls. <laughs> I'm thinking the same. If you want to, guys, you can go for it. Do whatever you want with your accounts. I'm just gonna uh, stay happily as mommy code. <laughs> I'm just gonna stay happily as mommy code. That's what I'm gonna do. My cheer is dreadful. <laughs> I like my cheer. It's actually see what I like about Mikotes in Final Fantasy XIV is that they're very, very cheerful, and very happy. Yeah, I'm gonna do cheer. And the, just my coats in general are just very expressive, very joyous and everything. I mean, look at the joy mode. Just so animated, I love it. And even the dance is the best. It's like you're just frolicking around. <laughs> I love it. I love every little bit of it. I'm gonna go ahead and get off uh, for the night. Thank you all for the. Dungeon runs. Let's do it again on uh, hold on, stream sometime. That'd be pretty awesome. If you can do this again on stream sometime, that, that'd be pretty cool. We are the Reapers, but we don't use the scythe. Red and me use the one, though. Oh, all right, sure, I guess. I suffer from the same inventory problem there. <laughs> I think at that point, everybody is going to be suffering from the same inventory. I hope they end up making it so that. Maybe it's expanded, especially if they're going to be adding new jobs and stuff in the future. That'd be amazing. Male or female, though, that's the question. Let's see, what butt do you want to stare at when? Well, nah, I probably don't want to say that. Uh, it's actually up to you, son. Well, son, if you hear me, it's... Here's the thing, whenever me and my friends make like MMO characters or something, we always ask ourselves, like, what butt do you want to stare at whenever you're playing an MMO? Usually all my friends, you know, me and my friends kind of pick female characters, usually, unless it's like a really badass looking male character. My buddy Ryan all the time, he feels like he has to make a male character because he is a male himself. And he kind of feels weird playing as a female character, and we always kind of make fun of him because he feels so uncomfortable playing as a female character. So he always makes it like a the most handsome looking. He makes some of the most handsome looking male characters all the time, because he feels like he has to since he is a male character. And I think he is a little bit. I think he considers some some, some handsome. I have no idea, but he feels like he has he has to make a handsome character <laughs> all the time. But anyway, we all kind of poke fun of him that. at that point. Make whatever class you want to make. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, be try I'll, be, I'll probably train a bit with Tankyo classes. That would be always good, kind of train around a little bit and kind of uh, get used to uh, like the new. I don't know, just I guess practice I guess against ads and mobs. Just see if you can handle them on your own and stuff like that. And if you can handle them on your own with no problem, then Tankyo is not going to be that big of a deal. At the same time, also. Um, Understand, Andre, that... Oh, wait, I probably should turn on some kind of music in the background, shouldn't I? Otherwise, it's going to be dead silent. There we go. Nice. There we go. You know, Andre, remember that uh, at certain points, tanking will become a lot easier because you are going to be... I don't know, higher level. You're going to have a lot more abilities to play with. And in general, you'll be generating a lot more... Oh, God. Threat. Like, for example, when I first started playing as my Dark Knight, I didn't really know what I was doing. And I could only do so much, but now we're at level 50. I feel like I can actually handle on my own a little bit. Um, able to manage threat in general or just hate um, in general from enemies. And uh, able to pop in other defensives to keep myself alive, <laughs> which is always good. Uh, but other than that, just uh, play around with it, have fun with it, mess around with it. If, uh, if Marauder is not your thing, try Gladiator. If Gladiator is not your thing, try Dark Knight. Because Dark Knight is actually, you know, A, starts at level 30, so you get a lot more abilities to play with. And it, overall, from my personal experience, has really good physical and magical defenses, which I personally really like about it. It's a really cool versatile tank, and I really thoroughly enjoy it. There we go. Anyway guys, it's already 10 p.m. for me right now. 
I kind of want to maybe try to sit down and record some stuff since I don't have any morning classes. So I may do some recordings. I want to kind of mess around with some things first and see if a certain game can work that I'm trying to mod. Because modern games is just something I really enjoy. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. It was really fun running the dungeons. Sorry I got home late. More, more, late night classes, I don't know. Guess enough talk from the Reapers so you can have the YouTuber back. Alright. Awesome. Work light. Sounds good. Anyway, uh, thank you so much for watching, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed. Uh, all new people that subscribe, thank you so much for watching. Please do vote in the straw poll for the game because I do want to make sure that we have the game chosen for us. Please do vote right now in chat. And if you haven't voted, please do vote. If you already voted, try not to vote again. Uh, spread it to your friends, you know, share a social link uh, or the, uh, the straw poll link with your friends or something. Be like, hey, uh, come pick a game or something. <laughs> So we can, you know, get our full Destiny winner. Right now, I believe the winner is Akiba Strip, which is pretty awesome. I'm looking forward to playing that. I'm looking forward to playing both Akiba Strip and uh, How to Full Boyfriend. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and just How to Full Boyfriend just ahead of time because if I don't, I'm gonna end up making videos and streaming both games at a certain point. Just I want to see what we can do here for a Sunday. Akiba Strip. The fact that we're gonna be running around stripping people sounds hilarious on its own and learning how to strip combat <laughs> so that should be pretty fun and dandy anyway guys thank you so much for watching hope you enjoyed my name is samuel hopefully tomorrow i'll be without glasses and actually going to be able to see not being blind anyway thanks so much for watching my name is samuel like subscribe and as always have a great day i'll see you all tomorrow around 7 p.m eastern this outro goes on for way too long and the stream rambles always happen for way too long anyway guys see you, see you tomorrow